All righty. What is up, everybody? I am here with, uh, I guess, uh, day number who fucking knows what of the fucking any percent grind. We only got a few more days left before I take a little break with it. So in honor of that, you know, we got fucking type of number three in the comments. If you're watching the VOD after the fact, number three is down below where you at. We did, we did the one day before. We did two yesterday, threes today. And uh, let's keep this, uh, let's keep this ball rolling. Let's keep these numbers happening here. But yeah, welcome, uh, VOD watchers. I hope you're all doing well today. Hope the vibes are right and whatnot. And, uh, yeah, let's see if we can get some, uh, some good runs today. I'm gonna go ahead and turn on the music. Let's, um, I'm gonna head straight over to Blowhard today, I think, because, um, it looks like, um, I, I was testing this level, like, a couple days ago, and it turns out, actually, that, um, I suck. And the, uh, IL strat actually saves an additional cycle that I didn't even realize. So I'm gonna just try to move quickly through this level for my warm-up. Try to do this strategy here. Which is really hard, but just try to keep it moving. Let's see how this looks. So I think that's the IL strat. Just so, just so I can check, I'm gonna be um, using the timer here. Just close the splits here so I can just get the raw timing of it. And uh, yeah, let's just keep starting at the start of the level here. Timing this shit out. Oh, that's okay. Here's the old strat. Then just touch the dragon right away so I can have consistent. That was 29 seconds. From the fly-in. What's up, Magni? Yes, you are early. Welcome, welcome. Good to see you. Oh, fuck. I didn't... I should have uh, reloaded the level. Um, but, yeah. What's up, Jupe? And uh, Elucidark. We need a three-way frame perfect tie. Yeah, maybe. Maybe I'll do it. You know, don't, don't test me now. Maybe I'll just do that. Maybe not. Who knows? What's up, HP? Thank you for the good luck. Chat's been working great lately, so thank you for that. Oh, hold on, let me, uh, let me reset it so right when the fly-in happens, I'll press the button. Here's the newer strat. I'm like, I'm getting all this. Obviously, I'm missing a lot of stuff because I'm not used to this strat. But I'm just timing things out. Yeah, that does seem like it would be a cycle faster there. I keep exiting level. Idiot. I'm just supposed to fucking reload the fly-in on because I have the practice codes. Clueless, thank you for the tier one today. Welcome. It says, good luck. Let's fucking go, dude. Good vibes, Clueless. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. All right, guys. I'm feeling, I gotta say, I'm feeling good today. Feeling smooth. The last few days, I gotta come clean. I have been, um... Smoking weed and whatnot. Does this respawn the uh, chests? Okay, good. Um, last few days, I have been smoking weed before stream. Today, I haven't. So maybe today, my paces will actually be good. That's the hope. I need to check to see exactly how Odd Kara does that. Or Ash, for that matter. I think they both do that strat. I am hitting the cycle now. It's just, um, yeah, I am hitting the faster cycle here, which saves like two, three seconds at least. Thumbnail on YouTube goes hard. Yeah, on Ma I took that picture today, actually, before stream, looking up at Mama Proxy right there. What's up, Energy Drink? They ask, uh, the charge I do the two, uh, thanks for the good luck, by the way, Energy. The charge you do on the two spin chests on treetops, is that a new strat or is that also faster than 120? Two spin chests in treetops. Um, I'm trying to remember what you, where that is. Two, you're talking about the two fan chests. You're talking about the very end of the level? Karate Bears, thank you for uh, the resub. You're talking about the supercharge where you go up, where you go up to the upper area from below. Um, yeah, the way, 
I, I actually picked up that version of it from um, from Toasted Cat. Uh, the old way I used to do it, you can see in my 120% world record is the old way I used to do it, which is technically faster if you hit both metal chests on the way up, which is possible. Usually I don't, usually I only hit one metal chest on the way up. And so with that, um, accounting for that, um, doing it this way where you do a, a full hop and then charge at the top of that supercharge ramp to give you a little extra speed and thus, you know, continue, you know, charging around a little bit more. Um, that's it's a little faster that way if you are if you consistently only hit one fan chest like me but technically doing it uh, the way I did in my 120 record is um, is faster if you can hit both fan chests on the way up not have to recover a second one you know what I mean Let me, um, I feel like I should watch real quick, like, a video of car. Well, let me just mess with this, um, let me just run up here and just mess with this for a moment. Just see how I want to do it. Because, yeah, I think you want to go, like, here and then, like, that would be the ideal. Well, right now, I would, yeah, Justin, I would have to do that right now because I'm missing a shit ton of gems. But, ideally, you would not miss any gems with this strat. Like, you'd clean, like, I'm just trying to figure out how to clean that up nicely. Ideally, I'm not missing any gems with this strat, and also I'm saving like two or three seconds on on a faster cycle. That's the uh, ideal situation. I'm just running straight up to that part right now. And then do it like that, and then turn it around. Man, that is tough. I mean, I just gotta get I just gotta get used to it. It's just gonna take a few tries, and I'll do it with the actual proper start this time. Ugh, tough. What's up, Gwendolyn? Welcome, welcome. Thank you for the good luck. I gotta make sure I really get the full hop and then charge on there. That's another thing that's a little different that I don't do. Okay, that actually collected everything. Let's see if we still catch the cycle. Yes, yes, just bear. Oh, I didn't start my time. That, that's, that, I, I'm pretty sure that saved a cycle over what I do before. And when I talk about cycles, I'm talking about the descending platforms here, those cycles. So I was one platform cycle ahead there. Let me actually time it again from the fly-in. What's up, DJ Hedgehog? more. There we go. Yeah. Oops. Oh, close. Not bad. What's up, Leonard? Uh, question, how do I know when to start the timer on live split? Timing starts, there's actually a bunch of screenshots you can look at on speedrun.com slash spiral one. Um, if you click on the game rules button there, like at the top of the leaderboard, you, you'll see screenshots of exactly when to start and stop your timer. But as a general rule, timing starts on first movement and ends, um, you know, on, on, well, it depends on what category you're playing, but generally timing is going to start on first movement. But yeah, check, uh, for the particular category you're running, check the leaderboard. There's screenshots of exa the exact frame to do, of when you would start your timing. Um, another confusion, since we're talking about it, another confusion I noticed with, uh, with another player about this is that your actual timer that you're showing on screen doesn't have to be accurate. I know that might sound crazy, but you can like speed run this game without a timer. What matters is that when you retime your run after the fact, you know, maybe you start your split a little early or a little late, you start your timer a little off. That's fine. We're human, you know, we're just manually inputting these times. But when you do get a run, you have to go back through later and put it through something called a frame counter. 
and actually select those exact fucking frames of starting and stopping and then the website will tell you the exact time. So you don't have to stress the timer being like super perfect, you know, while you're playing. You know, if you split badly or you started a little like a second late or whatever, that shit doesn't matter because you can retime the run after. All right, hopefully that helps. But yeah, timing starts on first movement. The, the first frame that you see Spyro move is when timing would start. There's no auto splitter for this game. There is one technically for emulator, but this game, since this game is split in real time, um, the uh, it's actually a load remover, not an auto splitter. I think it's a load remover and auto splitter that Lucia made for, for emulator specifically, but don't worry about that. <laughs> just don't worry about that. That's like just a that's just a fun like little experiment by them. Um, you have to time your runs in real time. What's up, D Tut? But you can check the timing of your run afterwards as well. Just so it's like super duper clear. I'm gonna not worry about timing this strat right now because I, I understand the concept. Let's just practice it. I'd love to get this in runs today. I'll probably fuck it up though. Nice, that's it. That's beautiful. I love that. I can't believe I did. For some reason, I wasn't like, um, last time I tried this, I wasn't doing it exactly right. So I wasn't able to actually save the proper amount of time with it. But today is different. You have to, it's that little part right there with the, uh, the firework chest and then killing the wizard box wizard two boxes and getting that all that smooth is what i'm really need to work on the rest of it's pretty much the same Ugh, keep missing that Schlappe. Come on, dude, just give me this game. I got fucking body blocked by him. Got ceilinged by him. Why do I flame after breaking the explosive case? Uh, no. Uh, it doesn't do that. I Sometimes I just flame just to flame. There, it, my flames don't always have a purpose. That's like a common misconception uh, from I've noticed from viewers. Sometimes I'll be doing a long glide and just flame for no reason. If I flame and it doesn't make contact with anything, it's not doing anything to extend my hitbox. Or There's no secret sauce or anything about that. I'm just flaming. Like it's not it's not that deep. There's no purpose to that. If you see a flame and it looks like it's for no reason, it is for no reason. Get <laughs> I, I know that's I, I hope that doesn't sound patronizing. I just get that question a lot. You guys really think this game is deeper than it is. Like that, that's like a, that's why it's funny to me. It's like you know, it's like I it'd be it'd be sick if flaming like extended my fucking sparks range and stuff. No, it doesn't do any of that. Gwendolyn with the tier three. Is that your first tier three? My goodness, Gwyn. Thank you for uh, for doing that. That's fucking chuggers in the chat for Gwendolyn. Cheers. Fresh Pocky, thank you for the uh, resub as well. Good luck with runs. Let's destroy the PB. We will do that in your honor. Fresh Pocky and Gwendolyn chuggers. I feel like I'm getting this strat pretty well. I feel like I could do this in runs, honestly. Like, I might miss some more gems here, but I feel like it's worth it to hit a better cycle in this level. Like, yeah, I might miss, like, a green there. Or that. <laughs> I just gotta I just gotta practice this start over and over, because that's really what's different. Yeah, first time tier 3. What a legend, Gwyn. 
Make sure, uh, Gwen, that you uh, join the di if you want uh, to join the Discord and uh, connect your Discord account to Twitch. Then um, a secret uh, channel will appear in my Discord for tier three subs, where we host, where I like to host game nights and stuff like that. We might do a Spyro movie script reading next game night. I usually host one like once a month. But yeah, you don't see that channel if you don't have your Discord connected to Twitch and also aren't a tier three. But since you are both those things, hopefully, just make sure you got all that taken care of. Bonnie Air, thank you for the resub. Appreciate that. Love you too. It's great to see you, Fawn, as always. Note to self, this is now a two stream streak. Yeah, good luck keeping up with that. The streakers are in shambles. Yeah, do it like that. Nice. Ooh, almost got that. No, I don't send dick pics. It's not my thing. I've never sent a dick pic in my life, actually. You hooked me up to a lie detector test, like straight up. Squish pick? I don't mind squish pick. You can squish whatever you want. Squish an emote. You should do that by your night. Dude, it's fine. Like, if you're a tier three, like, don't feel pressured to join the, the game nights and stuff. Like, it doesn't matter. If, if you don't use Discord or you don't care about it, like, it's, it's fine. Just letting you guys know that that does exist for the tier threes. Just gotta remember to connect your Twitch on your Discord user settings. You're in the Discord, you don't know when it'll update. Uh, like I said, go into your user settings and connect your Twitch account, and then it might take like, you know, a day or an hour or something, and then it'll show the, the tier three specific channel on, on my Discord once that all is figured out. It might take like a day, all right? So it's, I don't think the process is like instantaneous or whatever. What's up, Getro? Thank you for the good luck. I know HPAZ was having trouble with it. Did that ever end up working out for you, HP? Like, can you see the tier three Discord? The tier three stuff now? Or can you like type in it or whatever? Cause I added you as like an emergency whatever role, but like you like couldn't type and stuff. Yeah, don't worry. Like literally that chat is like super dead most of the time, except when we're like actually doing game night stuff. So yeah, it's, you're not missing much. Ugh, dude, I keep missing that with this strat. Oh, I was going too quick there. What's up, Matthew? Love you too, man. Welcome. This is a really good warm up. This is getting my head really in the game here. I'm liking this. Love it. Getting better at that. Good, 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 good. That's how you want to do it. Good stuff. Yeah, that alone is going to save me like two-ish seconds. Two, two, somewhere between two, three seconds in this level. If I can hit that. So that's good. It's huge. Oop, missing the jump. I hate missing the- I'm like missing those yellow chests like a lot now. For some reason. Fuck, that's another annoying miss. Like if you fuck these parts up, like you're missing 10 gems, you know? So many fucking blues and golds there. Really don't want to fuck up that part. Ah, yeah, that was slow anyways. Get overstimulated by online chatting. Yeah, I, I'm like the type of person that like overthinks every message I send. 
I'm definitely like that. But yeah, it's a very chill, uh, very chill space, the tier 3 hang. Even when there's like fucking six or seven of us in a voice call on game night, like we're not really too loud except for Goyle maybe. Pretty, pretty quiet bunch. Did we see the eclipse? Yeah, I'm sure most people did. I mean, I... It was like overcast. Like, it still is overcast. So I saw the the, the sky be like kind of twilighty for a moment. But it wasn't like... It didn't like turn like super dark and then super light. Like, it wasn't like that pronounced of an effect where I'm at in Virginia. I saw a video of some lady taking a video of the eclipse uh, in like Dallas. And it like... The whole fucking like... When the eclipse happened, like the whole city went dark. You know, and then like it came back to light again, like, whoa, you know, it went from like full daytime to like full nighttime. It was definitely not that extreme for us. Dude, fucking this up. That's still faster, by the way, than what I was doing before. Even if I have to wait on that platform, that still saves a second over my old strat. That's why it's kind of important for me to implement this. Really bad, oh my god. Jesus. Yeah, I know, honestly, Spyro should have like a, like a time, like a mini fly ability in this game. Like that would make a lot of sense. Like a little mini like bar like of like flight energy. It's like, is that section annoying? Just fly up there, you know? Quick. <laughs> I barely made that. Come on, that should have worked. All right, I feel I feel like I could do. I'm gonna do this once or twice more, and then we'll uh, we'll go look at some other stuff, and then do a run. I'm feeling I'm getting warmed up here. I'm feeling like I'm feeling like I'm playing kind of hot, kind of. Ooh, missed that. Big deal. What am I going to release Spyro for? I mean, I am the lead developer, aren't I? When Canadian guy says he has, he has to keep his cards close to his chest. He means me. He has to keep me close to his chest. I'll just blow the lid off the whole thing. I'll leak it early if you guys, if you guys really piss me off.
Wow, got lucky with that. It's the blue, but still good. Let's continue the rest of the level here. Finish it up. Oh, here's another thing is that you can, um, here, let me make a safe state right here. So right here, instead of doing this, this is what I normally do is go up there like that. What I need to do is this. Oh, hold on, let me set the safe state like right here. Do this. Like jump all the way forward there, which is scary because you're a lot more likely to bonk that way. This ledge is like really not, um lenient like let me just try some ballsy jumps and just see not that bad though seem to not be having too much trouble wait till i actually get on a run I want to jump flame there. I can also go along the right side here, which I won't bother. I will try this. Um, it's really hard to do. I'm going to come back to... Uh, I have to reload. Um, what are you guys talking about? What's up, Dan? Welcome, welcome. Glad you could catch the stream. Glad to have you here, man. Thank you for the good luck. Uh, we're not doing Nestor Skip. What's up, JE? Thank you for the congrats on record, I guess. <laughs> I think you're preemptively congratulating me. Thank you for that. Yeah, it's not a bad jump, Pastor. I'll definitely go for it. Watch me fucking bonk on a run, though. Guaranteed. Dodge all this stuff. Oh, here's another one where you can do, do this. That's crazy. And then I fucked that up. That, if Laura goes for that, which is fucking insane to me. I wonder if I can make like a safe state back here. I think I can't because if I, say I make a safe state like right, uh, like right here. Say I do that. Dude, it is so hard to hit that for me. Then say I load back here. Yeah, no, the guy isn't spawned there. So I gotta actually head back. Oh, fuck. I have to, like, just do the level from the start, basically. So, yeah, definitely incorporating some new things in this level, for sure. Ah, it's too too ballsy, too ballsy. That that will that would have worked. That was all going good there until I dropped trow, so to speak. This guy, that's why not. No, I see, I gotta not do that. And the reason why is because uh, you can do this. You can like glide up there early. So it literally, it's literally the same amount of jumps either way. It's just the way I do it is you have to jump higher the first time, technically. You have to jump higher and hesitate. 
get to do this and then do that and then and then jump up there whereas the other way you just go like this and then this and then jump up there so it makes more sense if it weren't for that early uh that you know that second ch chest allowing you to jump up early like same thing with this one like those are like kind of like new in my mind i gotta remember to do those Not making the exact cycle, but it's okay. If that happened in a run, that'd be fine. Oh, I forgot to grab the boxes. Idiot. Let me just no reset vibe this. Just hit those boxes. Continue on. Is that great? Excellent work by me. That's the thing, though, about what's going on here is, um... What sparks am I starting this level with? Oh, it's because I'm starting with blue spark, that's why. Because you take... You're gonna take... Doing this strat, you're gonna take two damage abuses, so you really can't even... Like, I gotta remember, if I go into this level with blue sparks like this, I have to, um... I have to do the old strat. I actually have to flame this. Um, flame this if I'm blue sparks going into this level, which, you know, shouldn't be the case usually. But, uh, is a consideration that I have to have. Like, the sparks level is relevant because now we've, we've added in a damage abuse, and there already is a damage abuse in this level, so now there's two, which means we have to be gold sparks here entering. Alright, well, I think I've looked at this level enough for right now. Let's head over to, uh, Dream Weebs. Let's do some, uh... Let's do some Bog. Let's do some rat, and then let's do some runs. My bogs have been getting a lot better, I think. So, hopefully this will be just like a quick little review here. Badminton is fun, dude. Badminton is dope. Oh, dude, that did not grab the blue. Missing like all the gems here, unfortunately. This is the problem with trying to go fast and bog. Look, look at how many gems I've missed. Five, ten. Just and this is just downstairs. Fifteen. We're not gonna count that green, but we will count this guy's green. Twenty, twenty-two. Okay, and we're not done yet. 23, 24, 29, 29 gems missed just that. And I missed more gems upstairs as well. Just for trying to go fast. 29 gems missed downstairs for having bad flame charging essentially. And, and taking some shortcuts. That's a lot, 29 is a lot y'all. What do I use for save states? They're called practice codes. You can type exclamation point practice codes in my chat for a link to a Discord in case you're curious about setting these up yourself. But yeah, basically I soft modded a PS2 and I'm playing a burnt disc that has, it's like a hacked version of the game to practice. I gotta like not go for that. If I am gonna skip this, I gotta like just be ballsy and just fuck that. They should name a dragon after me in Spyro 4. I don't know about that. I mean, that'd be cool. I wouldn't be mad about that. I don't think they will, though. Bad. Do this a couple more times till our gem count starts making more sense. I 
how lucky that guy didn't see me. What's that? I'll recover some of that with those gems. Okay, now because I missed that, I'm gonna go this way. Recover some of those. I like, gotta be thinking on your toes in this level. You love how this dude is always naked? Who, you? Your mom? Yeah, I love that she's always naked as well. What a hoe, am I right? Oh my god, fuck. Fuck, dude, why can't I flame charge them, dude? Why is that illegal right now? So annoying. Yeah, next thing you're gonna start accusing me that I shower naked too. You guys are disgusting. I always wear swim trunks into the shower. I love just missing gems here. There's missing gems everywhere. Zale, thank you for the resub, and thank you Scurry for the resub as well. It says hype. Thank you Zale and Scurry. Ballsy strap for fun. Are they available for emulator? Yeah, you can just download them off the uh, off the GitHub and just because it's like a dot bin and dot Q file, so it's just like the same as what it would be on emulator. I'm pretty sure that I mean I haven't tested it on emulator, but I'm pretty sure it works on it. What's up, Renji Kill? Love that. Love when that happens. All right, I'm feeling good. I'm gonna go pee. Well, let me do some, uh, let me go pee, but let me first go to Nasty's world and do some, uh, rat proxy practice and then we'll do a run. BRB. Let me open my splits up as well. Alrighty. What's up, Piggy? How you doing? Let me just respawn this. Respawn this whole area. Not gonna work. Yes, it will, actually. Oh, up the fucking open mouth. Fucking open mouth surgery over here. Look at that. <laughs> nice, <laughs> nice jump. <laughs> See, that's what I don't want to have happen. It's fucking up like that. Getting too far ahead of him. Too far left on that. Uh, that probably won't work, but let's see. Good attempt, good attempt. That 
Wahrheit sagt. Uh, that was good. I think that would have worked. What's up, Dismay? This probably won't work. Bad. We're getting a desktop today, nice. A whole new computer. Congrats. You buying it like pre-built or whatever? Enjoy, I hope it's uh hope it all works good. YouTube mods trying to be like Gestapo. I don't know who that is. Isn't that like the Mexican government or something? I don't even know. <laughs> the Spanish government? Gaspacho? Nice, that was gorgeous. Being like Nazi bully? Ah, dude, my mods aren't even doing anything. Oh, I see. It's the German Nazi. It literally is the Nazi police. I see. Now I know. Got a 3060, and I'll use it to play most intensive game ever, Skyrim. Skyrim is a great game, dude. I think Skyrim is a good game, especially if you're using mods and stuff. It's a good game to show off, like, the capabilities of your graphics card, or to, like, test the capabilities of your graphics card. It's not too demanding. Like, you can get it to look good on a... As you were joking around, you can get it to look good on a like not top of the top of the line graphics card, but having something that isn't like bottom of the line does help as well in a game like that. So ni nice, nice balance of, of GPU uh, requirement on a game like that. What's up waifu? Yeah, I don't mind the base game. It's got, dude, everyone always says that like Elder Scrolls, like if you play Elder Scrolls without mods, you're like a fucking masochistic. You like BDSM and getting your balls tied up in a knot and fucking getting choked choked to sleep and stuff, you know, but it's like, it's not that bad. It's, it's fine. Like, like the game is fine as a base game. Like obviously some, especially if you get used to certain mods, like, yeah, then you can't live without them, but it's the actual base vanilla game of Sky. And this goes for, for Oblivion and Morrowind as well. Like, I think they're all great games. Just, just the vanilla versions. But of course they are definitely propped up by mods. No doubt about it. You know? All right, guys, let's do a run. I'm ready. I'm feeling good. Yeah, I remember that SBR. The, the Xbox 360 Skyrim experience. So it was the same way on Oblivion. And Morrowind, too. You guys, um... You guys ever play Morrowind on Xbox Original? That is like, you want to talk about long load times. Holy fuck. That was my childhood right there, man. Just sitting on those load screens. And once your character starts getting more powerful, you can like traverse the map. You can like jump across the map and stuff. You'll be like, you'll, there's like a little loading area thing like in the bottom that it's like, it'll be like loading area. And then you fly across another like, you know, 100 meters or whatever. Then it's like loading area. <laughs> it's like that you fly another 100 meters. It's funny. Yeah, you make yourself a coffee on the, literally, that's what I do as a kid. I go get some snacks during the load screen. Like, actually just loading into the game. That would take, like, a good two minutes, two and a half minutes. Wow. Oh, that's why you got your uh, OG Xbox chip. That's interesting. That's a very, like, uh, that's a funny, like, kind of roundabout way of, play of, like, getting better load times in Morrowind. It's like, just play on PC. No, no, no. Let's get our <laughs> Xbox original modded, you know? It's funny. Three, two, one, go. Funny solution. Is that a much better proxy setup? Uh, yeah, basically, Waifu. Um, probably, I don't know how much you watch this category, but when I last got, like, record in this, like, in 2021, 
um, the rat proxy setup was different and and much more like RNG based and just less consistent overall, even with good RNG. So now now rat proxy is a lot more consistent, making this category actually a lot more interesting than it ever. Yeah, it was if you watch my GDQ run, then yeah, that that was like the old setup. Uh, it's a lot more consistent now. We we call the new setup back rat because you charge him from from behind. A lot less, a lot less relying on the rat movement RNG. It's a lot more um, execution. There's a lot more execution factors to it that that add to its consistency. It's not a hundred percent consistent though, so it's like you know usually your runs will still die there anyways, but at least it's not like a total like fucking. Like one in a thousand type thing, one in a hundred. It's more. It's like now it's like a one in ten, instead of like a one in a, one in a hundred. What's up, bomb buns? And yes, I am just totally pulling those numbers out of my ass. <laughs> You're ascended. Welcome, White Snowpaw. You can get that flame like before charging the ram, but it's just safer to just charge the ram and then flame for, for that reason right there. Just so you're not dealing with any hitbox silliness. What's up, Poli? Welcome, welcome. I'm feeling good today, guys. I mean, I am pretty energized. I'm still sub one hour into stream right now, but um, I definitely feel like I feel hopeful for runs today. Maybe that... <laughs> Usually when I'm hopeful and bright-eyed and bushy-tailed, that usually ends up with me getting extra mad when things don't go well, so. Let's hope that that isn't the case. Let's hope, even if things don't go well, you know, let's be ready for that. Let's not expect things to go better today, but let's let's be hopeful. I stole Sarah's happiness for today. She had to go to the doctor, because... Bladder stuff, UTI stuff. So yeah, she's been she's been struggling. What's up, Michael? Thank you for the good luck. Thanks for uh, joining the uh, Patreon, by the way, Michael. Appreciate that. Joy and wonder for speedrunning restored, yes. Fuck. Press X, homeboy. Homie. What's up, homie? It's Tony. You guys see those fucking shorts, the fucking, uh... He's like a Chinese, like, light box salesman. But he, like, his Eng he, like, switches the English accent for every short. So he'll be like, he'll be like, Hello, mate, it's Tony. <laughs> he's like this Chinese guy. So, I don't know why it's so funny. And then all the comments are like, new accent just dropped. <laughs> and he'll be talking like, like a Rastafarian in the next one. Oh, man. I'm glad you like the thumbnail, Tom. I got a, another com a compliment on that earlier. I literally took that photo today before stream. I took a couple of thumbnail shots so that way I wouldn't have to worry about it for the rest of the week. It from the back is faster, which is true uh, in real life as well. In my case, what's up, Jaws Nester? Oh, just missing those reds, no biggie. Flame charge, you love catching that.
<laughs> What's up, Jord? How do I find a multi stream? Dude, Lone Stone is not in attendance. <laughs> let, let it be known. They don't exist. That username right there is a it's a farce. Um yeah, multi streaming is dope, dude. I love it. No, you see, no, you don't want to have two chats open. You that that does not work. Our brains cannot process. No, I hate that as well. You need to find a good multi-chat. Um, stream Elements actually just dropped a good one. The one I'm using right now that you see under my stream, I actually had custom made for me by uh, shouts to HPAZ in the chat. It's definitely like the infrastructure of multi-streaming um, is another good um, another good multi-chat is the restream chat. You don't have to pay for restream IO, but you can use the chat. But you do have to like connect the stream. But the thing with multi chats is you have to like constantly like re like uh, reconnect. Like with YouTube streaming, it's an I'm sure you've YouTube streamed before as well, waifu. You know it's kind of annoying. You have to like sort of like make sure that you like update the title and the thumbnail and then make sure it's like connected to whatever chat you're using. If you're not just using like the raw pop out chat. Like there's a lot more of like making sure that or if you're using the OB the OBS plugin, making sure that that's like communicating with the actual stream crew that you know because sometimes it'll be like you go live on obs but it doesn't work or you know maybe you turn off the stop streaming button but it's still going on youtube because that button's still on or vice versa and it gets confused the api just sucks basically so that's like one of one of the annoying things about multi-streaming but once you have like um like in my case you know you, uh, you get like kind of a you get used to like what works and what doesn't and what the workflow is with it it is definitely a higher work uh, workload before stream like I you know making a thumbnail before every stream for example um, but I think it's worth it for me I like it I like multi-streaming the ad I'll also say this uh, to, if, if money is like a, a question about it is uh, the ad revenue from like the live streams isn't quite as much as like what you'd get from a video because um here, hold on, let me focus. So on average, my streams get like maybe 1.5 to 3,000 views. And so a video that does that would make like maybe um, like 10 bucks, you know, 10 to 20, 10, $15. Um, but a live stream makes less than that in ad revenue because uh, the amount of ads that are dispersed are less. And you can set it to be more aggressive with ads, obviously, but I I like using YouTube. Another, one reason I really love multi-streaming is because then I don't have to feel bad about running ads on Twitch or be like super on top of that. Like, okay, guys, ads are playing right now, blah, blah, blah. It's like, hey, if you don't like, if you're a pleb and you're seeing a million ads on Twitch, just come watch on YouTube. There's like a way less ads there and you can skip them. So it, it makes a nice like kind of out for me. Oh, that's not gonna work. It's a reset. It, it makes it to a nice system to where it's like, okay, I can just run like all the ads on Twitch and like not think about it. Cause the moment you start having to be like, okay, let me like snooze the ad break and try to run ads optimally during breaks. It's just like takes up way for, in my experience, it takes up way too much energy, you know, for it to even really be worth it. Especially considering that a lot of subs and people who are watching like doesn't even apply to them, you know? Three, two, one, go. So I just run max ads on Twitch now. Don't even worry about it. Like, just let them play if they're going to play. If someone has a problem with it, hey, here's a link to the YouTube in the chat. You can watch there. So that's another big reason why I like multi-streaming. Yeah, HP is trying to make his chat, like, you're. I think that's what you guys are talking about. He's trying to make his chat, like, accessible for... Anyway, right now it's just designed so that my channel works with it, but he's making it so you can like log in with any channel, obviously. But I also want to reiterate, like, uh, and this is kind of unfortunate for HP that like he started this project before this got right before this got announced. But uh, Stream Elements also made a multi. -chat. I, I haven't tried it yet, but they just also released a multi chat that works for like Twitch, YouTube, Kick, I think maybe some other platforms, TikTok maybe. This multi-chat that I'm using is just for Twitch and YouTube that HP made.
Yeah, once the um once both the chats are combined into one, it's really just like it's just like streaming like normal at that point on just one channel. And you can see the little badge between like, you know, who's coming from where and whatever. But yeah, using two separate chats at once is literally impossible. You'll never be able to keep up with that. You can't comment on the YouTube stream? Uh, I don't know. Are you logged in? <laughs> I, there are people that are typing in my YouTube stream. You might be um, you might be blocked in my YouTube stream. That's another idea. I don't know. Try signing in with a different account if you want. I don't, I don't fucking know. Do one of my tech support. Oh. <laughs> Maybe you are blocked <laughs> with, that, with that attitude. You fucking hoe. <laughs> Yeah, this chat does not show channel point redemption, so maybe that's something HP can try to work. What's up, uh, Dragon Blood? I actually have a separate. Uh, what I do um, for that waifu is um, I have like my multi chat there, but I also have like my activity feed from Twitch specifically popped out, and then I also have the YouTube chat, but just the fan funding tab popped out underneath the activity feed. So it's like kind of a double activity feed situation. That's right. That's right next to my chat. So that way you can see all the actual Twitch specific like little redemptions and stuff on the Twitch activity feed, including subs and all that. And then you'll have like YouTube specific stuff on the YouTube. Uh, Cause I don't think any one chat is going to be able to cover all that stuff without like doing a lot of bot work or maybe getting HP, you know, to fucking like try to integrate all that. But at the end of the day, you're going to need, like, the activity feed for at least some of those, like, little, little tiny, like, channel points, stream streaks, which I got rid of, by the way, fuck streaks. Stuff like that, you know, it's like... It's hard, it's hard to get those things implemented into a third-party chat client. But yeah, I don't use the, uh, like... I don't use the, um, you know how like Stream Elements or Stream Labs have their activity feed? I have that on another monitor for like donations. So I have like three, I technically have three different like activity feeds. The direct Twitch and YouTube ones are like right next to my chat and then like the donation one is like right here on my third monitor. In case uh, people uh, throw money at me. And then in my case as well, anytime you um, you you do a donation, it'll like, play it aloud too so I generally won't miss it anyways that's just how my setup works and it works I think this works well for multi-stream yes it and like I said it is definitely more workload than just streaming on one platform but I think I have it in a way where I, I can still catch like everybody doing everything on each platform maybe not maybe I don't always catch it instantly you know maybe the alert doesn't always play or whatever that's another annoying thing is like if you want the alert YouTube alert to make a noise and the Twitch one and you're, both of those are on stream elements, you might want one on stream labs and the other on stream elements. So that way you don't have to be like logged into two different profiles on the same website. I had to do that today. I had to log out of the stream elements, YouTube, re-log in and then log back. So that's what I'm saying. It's like the infrastructure for this stuff isn't super like solid yet, you know, so you kind of have to like develop your own sort of strats with it all. But I think what I have works good. Oh, you've already, so you've been multi -stream. Oh, okay, well, there you go. I thought you were just getting into it, my bad. <clears throat> yeah, I can't believe you. You've been using multiple, like, chat windows for two years. I, I can't, I don't know how the fuck you do that. You did that. No, the moment I started multi-streaming and, like, I, I tried using two chat windows, I instantly knew I was like, I can't do this. Like, that's impossible. That's fucking impossible. I am, there's just no way I'm reading two separate chats at once unless they're both combined it's just funny the way our brains work is like it's like i can read all the messages from both chats as long as they're combined into one chat but the moment they're two separate windows it's like my brain can't process that it's kind of funny it's like i'm just gonna end up ignoring one <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
I see what you're saying. You're having the chat get. You're like using a bot to like repost YouTube chats into your Twitch. Ah, there you go. Yeah, obviously, there's a lot of ways to do this sort of stuff. Okay, let's see here. This might work. You are a bitch. My first run today, I hit her too far into the corner. That run, I hit her too f not far enough into the corner. So the third run, this one's gonna be the one where, where if this run that I start right now, um, if it doesn't work with Mama Proxy, I, I'll just continue. It's fucking Mama being a hoe right now. What's up, Olegja? Thank you for the good luck. I don't dream about this game or speedrunning really at all. I know that might sound weird, but it's like, how often do you dream about your job? You know, probably not that much unless you're like, unless it lives in your, unless you're like Sarah and your boss lives in your head rent free. I do a pretty good job, especially when it's like something like this, like gaming or streaming or whatever. It's like, you kind of have to have that, that mental compart compartmentalization. Or you're not just constantly like thinking about like, okay, what well, the next strat and spiral? Okay, let me do this. Oh, what's this person doing? You know, when you go, it's very easy to get like wrapped up in this whole like Twitch, Twitch's Twitch sphere. You know, and so I think one thing to like what one like mental health thing that I I think I've gotten a good grip on over the years is like when I'm done streaming, like I don't think about like others unless I'm like really gonna work even if it's like working on a video or something I like maybe I'll render a video that night but not usually like if I'm gonna actually work on a video I'm just gonna not stream that day you know what I mean it's like the compartmentalization it's like all right I'm gonna do this one thing today and when I'm done I am just gonna kick back drink a beer and make dinner you know and that's it you know and watch videos that have nothing to do with spyro or speed running you know? So yeah, to that end, I don't really like dream or obsess about stuff like that. This game doesn't really live rent-free in my subconscious like that. Thanks for the good luck, mind and organ. But it's funny because I think the people who are like really successful in these hobbies are the ones that are like unhealthily obsessed that are just constantly, okay, the minute you get done streaming, now you're working on a video and then you're not doing that. Okay, let's make some social media, like little fucking like, you know, TikToks and stuff and just endlessly like making just on this endless workflow and then like hiring people to help you and constantly talking to editors and stuff like that. It's like, it's a whole, uh, it's like a whole ass, like endless grind if you, if you let it like take over like that. And I, I don't like to, I don't do that. And that's at the cost of me putting out like a higher uh, frequency of like videos and whatnot. I don't post on social media like hardly ever. And that's fine. Like it just, it's just like one of those things, you just gotta know yourself, find what works for you and what makes you happy. Oh God. Perfect. I've been talking too much lately. I mean, you, you're talking too much. <laughs> you're a bitch. I like talking and, and streaming. I'm, I'm sorry if, like, actually, I'm not sorry. I realize that sometimes my gameplay will suffer for me talking, but, like, fuck you. Like, it's my stream. I, I can talk and play, and I'm still trying my best. I'm still trying to get good runs, and this is just how I want to do it. Sorry if you, if you find that to be, like, suboptimal or whatever. Here's another here, another way of looking at it is if I'm just quiet and not saying anything, like take the mic away and I'm just focusing on the game, maybe my runs might be better. But like I'm not a I won't be able to like really um emotionally like deal with what's happening as well. I'll burn out more quickly doing it that way. So it's not like a perfect solution. It'll just it's just a more uh, intense approach, what you're suggesting. I don't think there's anything wrong with being like dead silent either. I mean, sometimes I'm quiet, like as uh, Jay said, like sometimes I'm quiet, sometimes I'm not. Like it's just really how I'm feeling and what I'm trying to, what I feel like doing. Like that's the beauty, to me, that's the beauty of speedrunning and streaming is that I can be quiet and focus on the game and you guys, you know, won't leave. You know, you guys are still interested in that. And I could be talking and playing and that's interesting too. Like, 
I don't have to like be any particular way. I can be however I want to be. I don't have to feel like I have to entertain you guys or vice versa. And yeah, and I've definitely gotten PBs while while talking through runs, you know, it's like it's not it's not like it's not so black and white that like, OK, you talk, your runs are always going to be worse and you don't talk. Your runs will always be better. You know, it's like it's we're, we're complex creatures like that, you know. We're different versions of ourselves every day, you know, and if, if I want to talk the way I'm like, like if I want to talk, I'm gonna talk, you know, what's that? Doesn't mean I'm not trying my best in this game, you know. Dude, sometimes I'll be like mid conversation, I'll be like, hold up, and then I'll just like focus on like a particular trick. You know, just however I'm feeling. The stress of a run got me tired. It's usually the other way around, Buggy. Is when a run's getting me stressed, that's when I'll I'll be quiet and start focusing. Like once I'm on like a good pace and I feel the pressure and the nerves, that's when I'll stop talking so much. But you know, speaking definitely helps to what you're saying. Speaking helps to kind of alleviate those nerves and get you in a more stable mindset for sure. <laughs> the guy in the top left corner is playing. No. Yes, I am. Yeah, there's a lot of mes muscle memory going on here. But then there's also a lot of active focus that impacts that. So it's not all muscle memory and it's not all active focus. It's not all about being entertaining and talking. It's not all about just being quiet and focusing. It's There's some balance of all those things that get you to where you want to go in, in this hobby. For me. And it just that balance just varies on the day to day, just on how I'm feeling. I just gotta follow. It's one of those things where you just gotta follow your heart, what you're feeling that day. You want to talk and play, like fuck it, dude, just do it. Like, who cares? You don't want to talk. You don't want to have a face cam. You don't want to even show your splits. You know, you don't want to stream. Then do that. You know, like there's no right way to do this hobby. Well, like I said, Cryogen, it's both, you know, there's, there is a lot of muscle memory when it comes to route learning and execution of the same route over and over. Like right now, I'm like, I'm not even thinking I knew to hold just X and square there. and don't even have to look at the screen there. Like a lot of the movement is muscle memory you know? and, and a lot of what you're saying is true too. It's not all like one or the, it's not so black and white, you know. Like both things are true. What's up, Tool uh, Terrellus? Thank you for the good luck, man. And Chocobo, thank you for the good luck. Launtress with the Prime, love you, Launtress. Thanks for the good luck, man. At least I'm hitting that jump every time so far today. So yeah, if I fail Mama Proxy, I will try to continue this run. Just because I've been I've already failed it like in like two runs already. Yeah, pressure's on. Let's see if we can actually get it here.
There we go. Hold it up. Oh, barely. We're good. Yay. You practiced some speed tricks last weekend. Mama Proxy is really hard. Yeah, I mean, it's a tough trick. You're just playing around with the tricks, or are you thinking about learning, like, um, a are you trying to, like, run a particular category, do you think? Like, any percent, 120, whatever. Or you're just messing around. I missed the 10 there. If I miss the 10, I'll be kind of sad. You're thinking any percent? Hell yeah. Yeah, try some, uh, while you mess around with tricks, uh, try also on the side, just try doing uh, just a blind. Yeah, I did miss a 10. Um, try doing just a routeless any percent playthrough and see how it goes. That's what I always recommend to people who are like new to speedrunning. It doesn't have to be so serious right now where you like learn a route and all the tricks and stuff. You know, just see where you're at right now. See how bad you are right now. Like this is your chance to record yourself at your absolute worst like starting point. You can look back at that later and be like, damn, tight, you know. Like, I came so far, you know. So yeah, there's no pressure. Like this is your time to to suck, you know? And just do something and just get lost and have to go back for stuff and all that. All that. Die a million times. Game overs. All that. And if you're thinking about doing any percent, I would highly encourage you to try a blind any percent run. Yeah, good luck, Gwen, if you do. Obviously, just do whatever you want, though. I'm definitely keeping the pace up a lot better than yesterday, which is good, even though I'm a little under gemmed here. Wrong way. There we go. Thought I was coming out of Clifftown there. I missed a blue and a yellow in uh, Clifftown. One of the old VODs where you teach Strawberry how to wall glide out of Town Square was what got you wanting to try it out. Nice. That's cool that you checked that out. You freaked out. Yeah. Isn't that such an awesome feeling is like finally getting like some trick that you thought like you'd never do and like you finally after like fucking trying it like a million times you finally get it. It's very, uh, very exciting. I need a new uh, controller. This thumbstick is getting legit like gummy. Oh, dude, totally. I mean, all you got to do, Liam, is just try it yourself. Just load up an emulator and just try doing any one, like, little section of a level the way I'm doing it. Like, see if you can, like, watch and bring up a video of me or any other runner and take, like, a tiny, like, little five-second section of a level that seems, like, interesting or cool or whatever and just try doing it. Just try copying copying it over and over. Watch it back. Watch the video. Pause. Try it. Oh shit, wait, what was it? And then watch it, and then it's okay, they do this, and then you're just trying it over and over, like knowing what it's supposed to be and not able to do. It really gives you like a new appreciation for what you're watching. What's up, Panda? Thank you for the good luck. God damn. Oh, well, if they're new in box, I can understand that they would cost a bit more. I, I don't buy uh, new in-box PS2 controllers. I buy them uh, loose. 
Oh, fuck. It's bad. Whatever. I'll pay, for me, I'll pay up to $40 for a good controller. Up to $40. But the thing is, is like, I'll only pay that, that like $30 to $40 price range for just one loose controller. If, if it's like from a retro store and they have a return policy. Only in that case would I spend like, you know, more than 20 bucks on a controller. Yeah, the Ice Caver music is a fucking vibe. There's a really cool uh, remix on YouTube of this, uh, where someone recreated this song with the Super Nintendo sound chip. Look up uh, Ice Cavern SNES. That shit is a fucking vibe. I'm just gonna grab this. A little slow, but what are you gonna do? No, I always buy first party, like, brand Sony branded PS2 controllers. You don't wanna... Third-party PlayStation 2 controllers are just all terrible. I wish there were- I wish there was good ones. There's just not. As far as I know. And the annoying thing is that there's so many third-party control- But not just for PS2, but for like N64 as well. That they look exactly like the normal like first-party controller. They just don't say Sony on top. Or like with the N64, they don't say Nintendo on the top. So you gotta make sure you're like looking for that. I should not have done that, but whatever. You're getting anxiety watching all the paper thin margins of the movement. I feel that mind. I feel that. And what's up, Bonnie? He's scabbard, dude. True. The meme is real. Maybe saving a couple seconds here, I don't know. Yeah. Not bad. Did I play Reignited Trilogy? And if so, does it play the same when it comes to the jumps? No. Literally all of the mechanics and physics are different between the original trilogy and Reignited. They're just completely different games. Oh, that was so close to working too. I'm blown away. Unlucky. Now I gotta have the shit cycle here. I'm losing time. See if I make this jump. 
Oh no, I'm not making that. Yeah, that sucks. Probably losing like five or six seconds here. All because I barely like was a hair away from getting that movement. Unlucky stuff. This run is kind of on its deathbed right now, but I will continue for now. It's not over yet. I do have like a little hidden ace in the hole with a new blowhard strat here, so... We'll see. If I play well, I mean, I think I can bring it back. It's not exactly new strats, it's just a, the updated IL strat. People like Kara and Ash have been already doing it. Doing it. Just little micro adjustments, nothing too major. But it's enough to save you, hopefully, a, a platform cycle if you're slick. We'll see. It's unfortunate. Wish I could have grabbed that gem. Since Blowhard commented it's us. No, I don't think Blowhard watches my stream. I wish. Probably losing a second or two here, I'm guessing. Yeah, about even. Do 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 do, and we got some pretty decent gems there. We did we missed a five, but besides that, decent gems. <laughs> Fuck off! I hate you. What a slut that guy. Come on. I'm gonna be like ten seconds behind. Like I said, run is on its deathbed, but I don't want to give up on it yet. Still has signs of life. The fucking, uh, the life support is going beep, beep, beep. <laughs> Not ready to bury it yet. I won't let you die on me. Beard God, thank you, Alessia. What up? Your grandma's on life support. I hope she fucking dies. I'm kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm sorry. I, I was. I would. I, I let the intrusive thoughts win there. I gotta be honest with you. <laughs> Who's gonna die first? My run or her? Spyro's grandma. Let's see what happens. Okay, blow hard time.
Beautiful. Oh, do this. I, I, ooh, I kind of killed all this time save there by, because I was practicing the wrong movement. Like in practice, I would like go straight into the dragon. I don't know why I taught myself that bad muscle memory. Yeah, so there goes my time save, but whatever. That, that's what I get for practicing it wrong. Honestly. Oh, and also I did not have gold spark, so I wasn't going to save time anyways. Another oopsie by me there. So yeah, losing time here. But at least I did the strat right. I mean, that was cool, but everything else was bad. Still breaking even, I guess. There you go. Yeah, you can definitely see where that blowhard has room to save like three or four seconds for sure. Thank you for the good luck. Have fun, Ash. Appreciate it. It's good to see you. Everyone tell Ash. Everyone send a heart to Ash. For tying world record yesterday. And being cute and shit. This run needs mouth to mouth. I think you need mouth to mouth, you fucking slut. Thank you for the good luck, Nicholas. That wasn't going to flame charge. Check my gem count. I need to take a look at that. I'm probably under gemmed, I'm guessing. Someone someone type gem at the end of this level. Just type gem in the chat right now just so I remember to look. Knowing my stone horny, I'll forget it. Oh, this might be close. Now we're good. Total gem count, it'll flash here for a moment. Three, four, eight. Oh, that's actually exactly what we were actually doing better on gems than I thought. Who knows? Maybe I do have like four to six seconds of time save in bog, so hold on. This could be my chance to bring it back. We'll see. jump charge at the start. That movement could have been faster. It's fine though. Oh my god. Come on. Get up there. Not a beautiful start. Not a good start at all. Hold on. Just keep it moving. Keep it moving. That's the key with this level. Just don't get phased. Completely unfa- unbothered. Oh my god damn it, dude. I'm bothered. And if downstairs goes good, it can be be salvaged. Call me Ashriel Jr. for that one. <laughs> Alright, hold up. Just drop a quick 14 gems, whatever. Right, there we go. Dude, grab that. Grab him. Grab this. Don't. Oh, it's fine. I, I needed those reds anyways. That was wacky. I think I need this. Ugh. Could have been faster. What's up, Bethesda Lame Studios? My mother, my name's Spyro Man. Mm. What the fuck is that move? <laughs> he was like on there and then not on there. Oh, this run's so dead. <laughs> that was like what the? That was comical. Comical like edge grind there. <laughs> Oh, 
Let me take it to the end of this split, see how I'm feeling. Why don't I show the inputs? Because I'm lazy. Setting up an input display is not easy, and it's like it's just one more thing for me to like unplug and replug and figure it like get working before stream. It's just not easy, and then it like kind of clutters up my stream layout as well. And also, nobody looks at it unless I'm trying to like show off a very specific strategy or something. So it's just like kind of not really necessary to have there all the time. I mean, I'll just can I mean, I should re if I'm going for a PB, I should reset at this point, but I'm going to continue for now. This run isn't like the worst run ever or anything. I'm not going to let these splits gaslight me into resetting right now. I'm just going to continue. If the pace pals, if the YouTube, if the bitches in the YouTube chat specifically don't like that, you can suck my dick. You'll donate 100 if I stream with spray painted purple body. Yeah, no thanks. You know, there's a video of Saboom dancing uh, with his with his face spray painted purple, wearing like a purple shirt. I have the gif of that somewhere. Oops, I fucked up terribly there. I wasn't paying attention. I'm not making this. Am I making this? Hold up. Go, go, go. No, dude, the missed jump. Come on. Give me this. For the fans. Dude, the pushback. I don't like that. Just hit it. Oh, I don't think that's going to work. I don't think that's going to work, dude. My life is a joke. It's the worst start ever. Guys, be honest. Do you hate me for not resetting this? You guys all just are you guys all just um, combined and just disappointed in me? Or does nobody give a fuck? I have a feeling it's the latter. What? How did I not have... Oh my god, can I have it? I was supposed to keep my supercharge there. I think I might have been just like... Too far on the left of the ramp there. If I had just followed the middle of the ramp, I think I would have been... But I also kind of did the charge kind of early out of the air. I should have like... I need to remember to really get like a proper full hop before charging. And then just follow the middle of the ramp. Just to really guarantee like the... That high amount of speed. Because that just barely wasn't enough speed to continue the supercharge upstairs there. Annoyingly. <laughs> Thanks for the kind words, everybody. I love you guys. We can do it. <laughs> oh my god damn it, dude. Fuck. Please. I'm just gonna do this. Just skip those fives. Who gives a fuck? I will grab the extra, though. Is Sparks' gem collection range not consistent? Uh, no, it is consistent. It appears inconsistent, but it is actually consistent. just love throwing these runs. I, I love sucking. What's up, L2? Welcome, welcome.
kind of crazy. I lost how many seconds in treetops? Like, I know I was losing time there, but damn, that was a lot of time on. Surprise me. I sometimes I surprise myself with how bad I really am. down a five, but if I get this early one here, then we're good. Easy. Classic. Beauty. Wow, love that. Nice one. Yeah, mama looking sus in the thumbnail, true. Bro, why do you guys keep... I know you don't... Maybe you don't mean to, Brian, but like... Why do you guys keep asking me that question? That's the second time I've gotten that question today. No, I don't dream about this game. I, I mentally compartmentalize this game so that I don't really think about it much. Not playing it. When you dream about stuff, it's because it's in your subconscious. It's like you're, it's, it's something that maybe you're not actively thinking about it, but it's in the back of your head. This game does not exist in the back of my head. It exists in the front of my head so much that when I'm done playing it, I'm done thinking about it. So therefore I don't dream about it. There must be a part in the later game he hasn't reached that he isn't a hundred percent. He wants to try it since he's close. <laughs> I mean, that's a theory. I'm not going to agree with it, but you can have your fucking silly theory if you want. Yeah, I'm definitely under gemmed here. I should have, instead of reading the chat, I should have uh, focused on my gem count, read the gem count. So let me grab this extra green here. It's super slow there. Probably gonna have to grab some reds, maybe the extra blue outside, we'll see. The rare full collection there. We need three here, or we need two here. Here. Yeah, it's funny, but there's a lot of attacks in this game are like that. Like, for example, the snowballs that the guys throw at you in Ice Cavern. Like, there's a lot of projectile attacks that literally do nothing to you while you're charging. 
<laughs> it's like it's a really it really uh, lowers the threat level of some enemies. Sucked. Somebody's like doing a burnout outside. That was distracting. All right, let's see. Oh man, that was so close. That was good. If that had proxy, that would have been a good proxy. No, that was terrible. I didn't press right quickly enough. Is there a running page of questions? No, I mean, you're good, Brian. I mean, I'm just, I'm just commenting. I'm just commenting on the fact that you guys ask me about me dreaming about this game a lot. I think you guys dream about this game a lot. That wouldn't surprise me. But I'm just explaining why I don't. Over and over and over. <laughs> I, I think Bex was working on an FAQ for me, but like, look, I'm going to just say this straight up. Even if I make an FAQ and just say, oh, just go read the FAQ. Like, you guys can't fucking read. You guys will never read that shit. There's no point. It's not like it's going to stop people from asking. You know? So it's all good. Like I said, Brian, I'd like, I'm, I'm not mad. Just pointing out that you guys always ask the same shit over and over. It's all good. I may sound a little passive aggressive about it, but rest assured, I'm glad you're here. There we go. It only took a million tries. It would be a weird fucking... Why would it be weird? People ask me a lot of the same questions over and over. I definitely need an FAQ, but it's not like... It's not like having an FAQ will stop people from asking. Like, I could just be like, just read the FAQ, you know? I guess I could be like that guy, but... I don't know. I'd rather just give you guys an honest answer and make fun of you for asking the same shit all the time. Is that weird? Am I like a... <laughs> am I a masochist for that? Like, whatever. Okay. We have outlanders. Yeah. Yeah, right. Why read an FAQ when you could ask me the same question every day? Yeah. Makes sense to me. No, I've not played uh, Spider Man 2 on PS1. I've only played Spider Man 2000 on PS1. And then I've played Spider Man the movie on PS2 and then Spider Man 2 on Xbox original. I'm gonna go pee, I'll be right back. Um, we're gonna get into some more runs, so stick around and thanks for watching everyone. BRB. Sorry I took so long. I kind of forgot about you. What about Ganasty Ganork? Nasty Nork? His toast. So now there's order again in the Dragon Kingdom? Well, mostly. I've still got some treasure to pick up. What will you do next? I'd say the sky's the limit. Yeah, I had a really nice flop there in the home world. Cool. Uh, no, I did not get world record. That run, to those of you guys who can't, uh, you know, read numbers or are unfamiliar with splits, um, I was, you know, when, it, when they're blue like that, that means I'm behind. I'm sorry if that sounds patronizing. I just know some, sometimes people are confused about that. <laughs> when it's green, then I'm ahead. When it's blue, then I'm behind. So I was behind on that run. All right. 
Let's do another run. Three, two, one, go. Okay, rolling. Oh, it's been peaceful. Yeah, that was good to get a reset out of my system there. A no reset, pardon me, out of my system. We'll see if we can. And I'm actually happy with how the pace was looking up to, up to whenever it started dying. But my actual like, you know, if without mistakes, my my level of pace is is better today than yesterday. Excuse me. I don't do rainbow splits, um, but sometimes speedrunners will have rainbow gold splits. I know you're probably just joking, but yeah, that is a real thing. Um, gold splits mean it's the best you've ever done that. Section. Bitch. Like, for example, I got a gold split fucking your mom, Tenchi Cat. So it would be like a rainbow split if I were to have my life split up. Does that make sense? Wow, that push was terrible. What's the rarest bug? I would say the rarest bug in this game is sound related. Three, two, one, go. It's whenever you um, touch a dragon. This can happen on any dragon, but some dragons it is more likely to happen than others. But in any case, it's extremely rare that when you touch a dragon, uh, instead of their voice line playing, uh, it'll play a sound test. So instead of being like, thank you for releasing me, they'll be like, beep. And then they close and then that's it. It's really, it's actually super fucking scary. It makes you like jump out of your seat. It's so fucking loud. So yeah, I would call that the rarest bug. One of the rarer bugs in this game. Jesus and Hagrid had a baby. You'd like to see Jesus and Hagrid have gay sex, is that what you're saying? If I'm understanding you correctly, is Mr. Beppis would like to see Jesus and Hagrid make love. Just making sure I'm understanding you correctly. Okay, good. Yes, that is correct. <laughs> Dude, that your time traveler kind of right on that take. Jesus is just thin Hagrid. <laughs> That's actually true. <laughs> Never realized that.
Thank you, Mika. Hope you have a fabulous day as well. Good artisans. Look at that gold. I don't know if I've ever gotten a 337 artisans before. Probably have, just don't remember. Yeah, I played vibraphone uh, in college. That was my major music. Vibraphone's sick. I have a, to those who are curious, I have a, a SoundCloud. If you type exclamation point SoundCloud in the chat, that has a lot of vibraphone stuff that I've recorded over the years. None of it is particularly amazing. It's all quite amateurish. But I hope you guys enjoy it. If you guys do care about that. Just jumped a little too early there. Ever tempted? Yeah, I have a music video, Callan, of a, a remix or like a cover of the High Caves music. It's called Space Caves. You can look that up on YouTube if you wish. Three, two, one, go. What's up, Mavrosa? Doing all right. I do not plan, before anyone asks, I do not plan on doing anything with music anytime soon. I'm mostly just focused on speed running, as you can imagine. You don't have to announce it like that in my chat, Callan, but thank you. Attention everybody, Callan is going to go listen to my SoundCloud. So if anyone wants to reach them, just wait a moment. <laughs> there we go, did we get the- yeah, everyone clap please for Callan. <laughs> But thanks for checking that out. Uh, was it considered a glitch the music would be changed after a level for too long? That's not a glitch. That's a, that's actually built into the game. There's just a couple of secret tracks that only play on certain levels when you stand in them for long enough. What is a glitch or a bug is when you pause and unpause or if the wrong music plays in a level. Sometimes that'll happen. Again, if your disc is scratched or something. Or it'll play the secret track like way too early or some shit like that. 
So that would be a bug, but it is actually an intended mechanic that a secret track does play on certain levels if you're if you don't die for long enough. What was the worst part of your day, Strawberry? Lay it on us. too high there. It sucks. You haven't had any caffeine at all today, huh? It's a shame. JJ Dev, thank you for the uh, raid. Welcome, dude. How you doing, man? I've just been chugging water today. Water drinkers, where you at? Cool, Callan. Glad you liked it. You have water, but it looks and tastes like Coke Zero. That sounds like water to me. Yo, Saxor. Good to see you, man. Runs are going all right. I'm definitely, I feel like my paces are solid today. You know, if so far we've gotten one run out of Mama Proxy and I went ahead and no resetted it. It definitely has definitely more PB potential today than yesterday, I'll say. So we'll see what happens.
greens and all that. Very nice. Is world record bonk free? Uh, I don't think so. It might be. Probably not. That my guess is probably not. There's probably at least one or two bonks somewhere. It's pretty hard to do a run of this game, like trying to push the movement and not bonk anywhere. Bonks like appear worse than this is something you guys got to know as viewers, as armchair speedrunners. You guys must know this. Bonks appear worse than they are. They only lose you about 0.6 seconds, 0.5 seconds. They look like they lose like over a second, but they really don't lose that much time. Unless they lead to other bad movement. Are there deliberate bonks? Um, I don't think so. Not off the top of my head. I mean, like, for example, in Ice Cavern, like, certain enemies you have to bonk on. The big guys, you have to bonk them off the edge uh, in order to kill them. Oh, I almost, bonk I almost bonked there, speaking of which. Got lucky. The lamppost, you technically can sideswipe, but, like, depending on your strats, you usually want to bonk at least one or two of them. So yeah, there are like mechanics in this game that require you to bonk for sure. But they're, they're few and far between. The fa speaking of which, the fastest way to turn around in a flight level isn't, it's not technically a bonk because it's not the bonk animation, but the fastest way to turn around in a flight level is to run into a wall and then like turn as you're flopping to go the other direction. So we take advantage of that in Wild Flight, for example. So yeah, there is definitely a lot of like strategic catch certain gems or cycles or what have you. It's not all like balls to the wall, you know, all the time. No problem. I'll, I'll check who sent that in a moment. Thank you, though. Losing probably a couple seconds here. Because my exit was slow on Shemp, and then that was kind of a slow level. Yeah. Uh, yeah, Callan. Thank you for the 420. Legend Callan. Cute spinners indeed. Yeah, you bonk on firework chests when you damage abuse on them, because that's faster than waiting for them to explode after flaming. Um. That sucks. Missed a lot of gems there. Trash. I mean, I only missed seven, but still. It's not the end of the world.
slow on those pauses. Still saving a second, though. Bringing back some of the missed gems. I feel like I'm Al Emperor Palpatine. Like, look, this might offend some of you guys, but I have never seen Star Wars, so I don't really know, like, the full context of what that means. I just know he's the evil guy that, like, zaps Mace Windu. That's all I know. Zaps Samuel L. Jackson. Oh. He's like Darth Vader's dad. That's all I know. And some time. What's up, Wasabi? And all these cycles as well. All bad, no? How the fuck have you, dude? I told you guys you would get all fucking pissy about that. I don't give a fuck about Star Wars, okay? Hmm? What do you think about that? Who fucking who? Star Wars is fine. I, I just don't care. Oh my god. Like, I don't know if you guys realize this, but like, I mean, I grew up with like, this game. Fucking, <laughs> I don't really watch movies. You know, I know this might sound like crazy, but I'm just not big on like TV shows or movies and stuff. So I'm just not a big movie guy, not a big movie buff. I've seen some movies, but like there is definitely a lot of classics that I have yet to see. Definitely uh, losing a bunch of gems and time there. That sucked. I've kind of killed my run there. I'm not going to lie. You think I'm cooler? Oh, that's sweet, baby. About Dune? No, I haven't seen. Isn't Dune the movie where it's like uh, the big worm monster, the Alaskan bullworm? I think I've seen snippets of that. I might be thinking of a different movie. So, bye, last. Thank you for the good luck. I'm on a bad cycle here. Unlucky. This is the camera. Yeah, the only TV I used to watch, like, growing up was, um, was G4. G4 TV. Being a little kid that was into video games, I love that fucking channel.
Definitely falling behind here, but it's not over yet. It's literally like same story as my last run, just falling behind in Magic Crafters. I feel that, Callan. That must have been frustrating. You've never played Super Mario? Mario. Ooh, I'm missing that blue, but not a big deal. I mean, kind of a big deal because I'm pretty under gemmed right now, but whatever. At least I got that one. when I do that. I'm just really bad at hitting that many percent for some reason. Dude, the time... <sighs> okay, whatever, dude. Fucking just disappear behind me, I guess. Fuck off, like... It's really bad magic crafters, man. Like, all day, like... I just, like, literally all of my good paces die in magic craft. That's how it's been this whole last week. Like, and I feel like my Magic Crafters aren't, like, terrible. They're just, like, not, like, they need to be perfect. And they're just not literally perfect. Like, how dare I? I know. Like, what a fucking cardinal sin. <laughs> you know? Gugh. I think going for both wizards at the start of High Caves is very time-consuming. Thanks for sharing. It's time consuming, so true. Dude, going for both wizards there is genuinely good. You can catch the exact same cycles. I mean, I just because I haven't today doesn't mean like that's not like doable. This is the problem, is a lot of you guys are only watching my runs and not really considering like the grand scheme of things here. So the recency bias is like crazy. Like, oh, you're messing up a strat recently? Must be a bad strat. You know, it's like, no. Uh, how, wow. This is terrible. This run's dead, basically. Sucks. I'm reset. I'm sorry. I, I don't feel like continuing that. I already did one run like this today. Why do most runs die in Magic Crafters through to Dreamweavers? Is it an execution thing, or is there something that makes those levels really hard? Uh, it's an execution thing. And and they're just harder. I mean, the game just gets harder as you progress through it. Three, two, one, go. But yeah, it's not that deep. I just uh, need to get some better levels, I guess. I don't really want to talk about this. <laughs> to be honest, it's kind of kind of depressing hey, subject matter like, for me. Oh, I want to just keep focusing on the game, just keep playing. Like, it's okay. It's okay that I've been messing up in certain places lately, guys. Like, I want to let you know, I will overcome this. It's not like I don't need the, my chat to come to the rescue here. Give me advice or anything.
You'd never cheat on me by watching another spiral runner. Yeah, that's the problem, is I'm not the only spiral runner, you know? Like, if you're only watching me, you're, you have a very narrow view of what spiral speedrunning is. What's up, Jadio? Thank you for the good luck. And that's okay. I mean, you don't have to be like an expert on this subject or anything. It's just like, once people start typing shit like, um, actually, I think this is slow or whatever. It's like, oh my god. You, t I, you could just tell instantly that someone like is not a, like does not do these runs or really is analyzing it like a, like a runner or someone who actually does play the game would. They're just like, they're just watching me and they see I mess up a lot in a certain pot, part and they're like, well, let me give you my advice. <laughs> you know, it's, that's, and that's pretty infuriating. I'm not going to lie. But, uh, you know, it's part of, part of the whole streaming thing. So, it's all good. I'm not mad at anybody. Yeah, no, you're not. No one's being a dick. Everyone's, you guys are all good. You guys are all beautiful and sexy, naked bitches. What's up, Jadio? Thank you for the good luck. and true. What's up, Regon? Good evening to you. Bad touch. That's pretty horrible. stream jingling key elements are is that like you saying like i should like have like some gta like car like tumbling down like 50 sets of stairs like a uh, 500 feet into the air like you know to the side of the game so you guys like are always visually stimulated is that what you mean Maybe once I start streaming on TikTok, we'll do that. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I think there's enough, like, what I would call stimulating, like, things happening on screen at any given time. The only, the only time that my stream really has downtime is if I'm on a loading screen and I'm being quiet. That's the only real downtime of my stream, of, like, what's going on here. Or I'm like taking a break, obviously, but just of the actual content of my stream. So I don't really need the additional stimulation, I don't think. If I was just sitting in front of a camera talking, then yeah, you know, dude, some additional stimulation for the brain rotted masses would help. In this case, I think I'm doing a good job. Yeah, no hydraulic presses necessary. What's up, ZVs? Thanks for checking out the VODs, man. I'm looking forward to hearting a future comment.
Is it an actual account of gems I picked? It says total gems collected at every level I enter. So if I was really on top of it, I could like really assess exactly how far or ahead or behind of the ideal gem count I'm on. The route that we do through this category accounts for, uh, you know, I need to focus. So it's like, say I miss that bird, you know? It's like, okay, well, I'm losing five gems there, but then I'll check my gem count again, like, say, going into Wild Flight or something. You know, I, just, I have a general feeling of how far ahead or behind I am on this route. And keep in mind, the route I do through this game account, like, gives you extra gems so that you can miss gems, you know? It's not like if I miss one gem, then I have to recover it somewhere else, literally. It's like there's a buffer of gems in the route. That's part of it. So you can miss some gems, but the more gems you miss, then the slower the end game becomes because you have to recover more. Or alternatively, you can't skip as many in the end game. Dude, what the fuck? Yeah, it shows, first of all, it shows every gem that's collected there, and it also shows the total treasure right there, so... I don't know if that answers your question or not, but there's that. And it also shows the gems you've collected level by level. I feel like maybe you were asking something different than what I answered, but hopefully uh, I did an okay job regardless. Oh my god, rip 10 gems. Slow there. La, 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 la. Yeah, definitely a bit under jammed so far. skewers are going to be good. The purple sludge is, um, it's grape juice. It's that dank shit. It's lean. Yes, I am aware of the safe pink sludge in Dark Passage.
What's up, Alex? Thanks for the good luck, GG. I see you up there in video games. Thanks, guys. Good gem collection here. Yeah, 210. That's like pretty much exactly what we want. Alright, keeping it pretty even here. Pretty standard. Standard good pace for me. Definitely PB slash world recordable here. We'll see if I don't get fucked in Magic Crafters again. Pray for me. I think that was a 10 right there. That's a. It's unfortunate. Norkson, thank you for the good luck. We're going for the other red. Be saving some time here. Right into the green, love it. We're gonna try to uh, recover uh, sparks if possible, because I would like to be gold sparks going into blowhard later on here. Like, I don't know if it's worth to like try to get a fodder there or what. Who knows. Give me this, please. Oh, thank God. I thought I was failing that for sure.
whole slow losing time. I have to be thorough here because I've already been so under gem. Can't just start skipping that now. What's up, Artie? Thank you for the good luck. The other this guy's got all confused there. Still got him. No way. I just missed all those. Craziest auto jump I've ever seen. No way. The game just hates me. The game just hates me. I didn't know you- dude, what the fuck? Game just hates me. That's all I can say, that none of that was my fault. That literally the game just hates me. Gave me a bad supercharge, basically. We're gonna continue, though. That jump- first of all, that first jump is not meant to take you that high. Secondly, that, uh, that cuck there is, like, pretty rare for the amount of speed you have at that section. That was just like pretty just like staggeringly unlucky, I gotta say. Please, no way. No way. It's over, everybody. Another run dies to Magic Crafters. It's totally my fault. I should really practice Magic Crafters, huh? Even though none of that was my fault at all, right? Fucking epic. Damn, that's really upsetting. And yeah, my run's dead, basically. That really, that really that really fucked me up. I'm gonna take a moment. I, I'm just gonna end this run because I don't, I don't feel like trying to no reset this right now. Um, and I'm just gonna take a moment and go pee. That was like really upsetting. I'm not gonna. Lie. I was really in the zone on that run. Game just wasn't having it. That that's I can't like I can't like stress to you guys how how unlucky that was. You you never I've never gotten a jump like that, and then right into a cuck jump as well, like. All right. It's it's literally not my fault. It's literally not my fault. Game hates me. All right, I'm gonna go pee. I'll be right back.
Three, two, one, go. Bepis, don't tell me how to play, bro. Thanks for watching, though. Appreciate you. Okay, rolling. Oh, it's been peaceful. That last run that died was not my fault. I was so locked in. I was so locked in. Literally, the game just denied it to me. But I don't want to talk about it. No use talking about it now. New run, new me. Let's just do it. Yeah, no, literally, that was just, like, like this game just fucked me, like, on that last run. Like, it's very rare for the Supercharge to do that to you, what you saw in that last run. Right, but thanks for the good lucks, everybody. Fuck off, dude. Three, two, one, go. Okay, rolling. Oh, it's been peaceful. Thank you for the good luck, Nash. Yeah, I'm glad you uh, you're enjoying the stream, Sky Dog. This is this is where it's really a grind, you know. This is the real mental strain that's happening here. What's up, Matt? Good to see you. Oh, thank you, Strawberry. Up to you. Yes, let's. there. I hope so, Brian. Furry squad, where are you at? I don't know. There's probably some furries in this chat. 
What's up, Jammy? And soul fans, where are you at? You're a furry and a fan of my pencil. Type an emote. Spyro R, is that like Sonic R? What's up, Dylan? Thanks for the good luck. What up, what up? Jeez, thank you, thank you. Oh, that must be a good feeling, Dill. People in the UK would never understand. I'd say everyone who's typing in the chat right now is an S tier, for sure. All the names I'm seeing. faces <laughs> that's what I look like after a day of runs by last smoking too much weed how much fun are we having with any percent I'm playing good today so I'm just I'm you could tell I'm really trying to just lock in right now my last run was super locked in. It just got fucked by something beyond my control, basically. dodge that slot. I got pretty much everything except for that one blue. Still good movement. Actually a gold. Surprised by that.
Good touch, actually. Hey guys, we're doing pretty good so far. Post a damn emo. What's up, Ken? Thank you for the good luck. Thank you for watching anyways, Dylan. Still counts in my book. What's up, Blue Eye? Thank you for the good luck. Can't watch from Twitch from work, but dude, don't you know that you can get emotes on YouTube by doing a membership? I'm done shilling, I need to focus. It's got the membership swag. Is this sub 200 gems collected? Okay, it's still over 200 gems. It's not that many gems lost. That one jump is weird though. Twelve thirty. That might be my best pace ever out of uh, Peacekeepers. Cool. Cyrus, thank you for the uh, resub. There's the emotes. <laughs> you found them. Thank you, man.
Uh, sort of, Iku. It's not... Can't really answer that question too in-depth right now. Sort of, but not really. Sucks, dude. Second run I've done that today. Thanks for the good luck, Iku. Just gotta keep it moving. Dude, really? A nut that guy had a gold as well. I missed tw I've missed 20 gems in this level. Think about that. I missed two things, barely. 20 gems. They were both golds. That's a huge deal. It's a big problem. Like, that is just so sad that I missed those two things. If you missed anything else except those two things, it wouldn't have been as bad. Actually, more than 20 gems under there. That sucks. That is actually super trash right there. Now, I, now I'm working from behind here. That sucks. Wait the f I'm losing all my green here, by the way. I have to wait this now. Unless I'm like crazy fast. No, I'm not making that. that sucks. That really hurts. That really hurts. I just can't. Like, Magic Crafters is the bane of my existence today. And it has been this last like few weeks. It's the only thing standing between me and record is Magic Crafters. It's just, it's, it's just always something different just going wrong here in this home world, and it's really, uh, really upsetting. I might just start going wide there if I'm gonna get the extra blue, because I just can't, I, like, I'm starting to really mentally struggle with this. But I'm not gonna crumble yet, I'm gonna keep focusing and playing, see what happens. Run's still pb I'm just, you know, I've just made it really hard for myself now. Another blue mint. Like each d miss gem at this point is like a knife through the heart. It's really, really just. This runs hard to cope with. I'm not gonna lie. There goes all my green. <laughs> cool. Ugh. Snuck it out, that was cool.
Good level. That's hard to save time on that split. That's pretty good. Double, but whatever. We're good. Thank you for the good luck, K of Chaos. that time loss was from the double miss double thank you chi yukes That sucks. That really sucks, everybody. It's okay. I had a real chance to pull ahead there. But that bonk cost me. It's a costly bonk. To wait this cycle here. I guess I didn't have to wait it. And by co you know, compared to my splits, it's not going to be losing time, but that c it could have been saving time, is what I mean. Whatever, who cares. Good enough. Good enough. I didn't choke it. <laughs> at least, at least we didn't choke it. Could have been more of a time save though. All right, we'll see how bad this gem count. I don't have a good feeling about this gem count, to be honest with you guys. But we'll see what happens here. Good home world. Let's see the gem count. Three, four. That is really low. <laughs> that is not good. I'm going to have to be very thorough in these next few levels. This is, I'm, this is probably the start of the end here. But I'm not giving up. No shortcuts in bog for me.
Oh, this game hates the game hates me. For not giving me either of those. Dog! Can't just have one bonk in this fucking level. God fucking damn, dude. You're good besides the bonks, I mean, Jesus. Cool, bad fucking... Jesus, I have to dodge that blue, and I really needed that blue as well. I'm gonna save some time here, I think, but it's, I don't know if it's enough, guys, I'm gonna be honest, especially with the gem count. I, I just don't know if this is enough. 435, I, I needed to be over like 440 there, unironically. We'll see what happens. Like, I need all of those flame charges. I need everything to work. Right now, I'm going to be so fucking under gem that even if I'm green going into the end game, it's fucked. That's what's, like, so fucking sad about this run right now. It's like, I'm trying so hard, but it's pretty... It's probably for nothing. <laughs> that's, like... That's where I'm at with my gem count right now. Missing both those reds. I need every little red I can get, and I'm not getting them. Like, I'm doing okay, but it's not, not enough. Jump, you fucked, quickly. Oh man, please make this. Okay, I think we're good. At least we got the, yeah, at least we got the teleport there. Dude, fucking matching the fucking button, dude. Thank you, Nasty Hork, for the sub. <sighs> the bonks in this run have just been so fucking stupid. They've all been just bullshit. Bullshit fucking coin tosses, every single one. God, I'm losing my mind. a couple there. I need that blue. I have to wait for that blue. There goes my green because I had to wait for the blue. Blue splits for blue gems, man. Cool. I'm gonna literally grab these reds. Cause I am so fucking under gemmed right now. Like this is where the time starts to lose here. I gotta grab all these reds. Like this is not good stuff everybody. Grab those reds, grab all the reds, grab them all. Do 
the 120 strat here. I'm going to be very behind here just for all this. Even though I'm playing decent, like the amount of recoveries I have to do on, on my gem count is like kind of fucking ridiculous. Kind of killing this run. Uh, the run was dead, you know, regardless of the pace. At this point, I'll be lucky if I'm like five, six seconds behind. Definitely bringing back some of the gem count there, which is good. I, I needed that. I'm probably still under gemmed a little bit. Let's see. No, we're perfect now. We're chilling now. Good. This is going to be time save here. Big. All right. So for the time I have sacrificed in Metalhead to recover gems, I brought it back with a better homeworld. But if I don't get the flop here in this homeworld, that's going to be time loss again, right back to five seconds or so. So we still need things to go kind of miraculously well here to PB. Well, we'll see what happens. That was the worst attempt that literally my fingers slipped off the joystick while I was attempting that. That was the biggest choke of the whole run right there. There was two mega chokes in this run. There was that, and then also that was like five seconds when I really needed it. And then also it was missing two gold gems in high caves to start the ball rolling with, with the fucking nonsense. Those were really like the big, big issues that like really put things, put things from like this can PB to there's no hope. At this point, I'm going to say there's no hope. There's still kind of, I'm going to be honest, there's still kind of a glimmer of hope that this can still PB, but I need like the jock of my life. I need a first try rat. I need everything to be perfect now. And it's just, it's just not, you know, it's just not in the stars. It doesn't feel like, it feels like the... It feels like the, the the world is against me. That's what it feels like. I know it's not, that's not true. But I'm so fucking locked in right now that I just, I can't be fucked about it. I'm gonna finish this run, no matter how bad it is. Or how good it is. The universe can't stop me. God can't stop me from trying to get a good time here. So yeah, what is that, like five? Okay, not that far behind. Yeah, there's, so there is still hope. It's just, uh, just tough. I have to collect the gold, I think so, right? Yeah. I have to collect the gold, but I can skip one of the fives. Dude. Okay, run's dead. Yeah, run's dead. Cool. Because I can't flame charge a single enemy. This is what I'm talking about, guys. Like, it needed to be perfect. This isn't perfect. Run's dead. I'm sorry. That sucked. That was crazy. I just can't flame, apparently, when I really need to. It's pretty epic. I need these greens. Wow. That's all I can say. I can, I can get as close as possible without succeeding in this game. That's basically what it is. 
pretty uh, pretty upsetting. That was that was a really upsetting missed flame charge. And honestly, I pressed the button. I'm willing to blame my controller for that, but also like you know, to cope. So I'm not even gonna bother. Just, uh, just really sad. This is a really sad run. So I think, what, I gotta grab the extra blue here. I'm, like, behind by however much. 994. I actually don't have to grab the extra blue here. Just grab this. I somehow got away. It's because I grabbed those extra greens there in that level. So we got away with murder. I'm plus 10. Yeah, this can't PB. This can get close. Is that is that exciting? Is that fun? We can get close to PB. Whoopty fucking do. Fuck this. Fuck my life. Not even a sub 36. It's so bad. All right. This is not gonna work. <sighs> Dude, these rats don't want to work. <laughs> what the fuck? Imagine my run was like a 35 4x, let's say. I didn't make any mistakes. And then I get two rats like that. <laughs> you know? Again! Again! Yeah, I mean, I tell you, I'm telling you, God doesn't want this run to work. I mean, fine, but I'm not going to stop trying. I'm playing too good today to stop. God hates me, whatever. I'm going to I'm gonna keep going. I'm going to do another run after this. I, I can't not do another run after this for how well I'm playing, for how locked in I am. Man, I'm so upset. Far left. That one should have worked, but I was too far left. gonna work. Please just give it to me on this one, please. That's probably- this is probably not gonna- dude, I'm too late anyways. Good attempt, but no. Are you seeing these rats? And you're really gonna tell me God doesn't hate me? <laughs> really? <laughs> there we go. Come on! Ah! Oh! No, clearly God is on my side here. Luck, luck, and everything is on my side for sure. Can't do it, dude. God is definitely laughing at me right now, for sure. Some of the wor these are some of the worst rats I've ever had on an attempt. I want to be clear because Jay, I can tell that I've struck a religious chord with you, and to anybody else who is religious here, like. I don't actually care about about God or whatever. Like, 
I'm just, I'm just like, I'm just, uh, I'm just venting, you know, I'm just, I'm just yelling into the, into the sky, you know, so please let me be with that, you know, it's really not meant to be anything personal about like anybody's religious feelings. Like, no, it's okay. God actually loves you. Like, dude, it's, it's fine. Like I don't, sure. Yes. I, God loves me. Great. You know, who cares? Like, <laughs> just so we're all on the same page here. Please just fucking work, dude. I just want this trick to work, man. This is crazy, man. Just crazy. Stage five of grief is acceptance, and I don't think I'm quite there yet, Zelda. Yeah, I'm just being salty, dude. Like, it's fine to be salty. Dude, I could have had enough. Like, let me have my salt. Let me, let me cast shade upon God himself to make me feel better. If that's heathenist to any of you, then I'm sorry. It's just my cope. Dude, I, just, I can't do this trick anymore. I just can't do it. This is the longest I've spent on, um, on Rat Proxy in like a hot minute. I literally can't do this trick. Dude, YouTube chat, you, the type of shit you guys type on YouTube is so fucking stupid. You should train more on rat. Dog, what am I supposed to say to that? Oh, you're right. Fucking dog, don't tell me what to do, all right? I'm not in a great mood right now. <laughs> like, please fuck off, actually. But thank you for watching. really giving me flashbacks dude until like I, th I thought we were past this point where like it would take me like 10 plus minutes to do this trick it used to be this way with this trick before this setup now for some reason I just can't do it yeah I mean YouTube chat please have like mercy on me here like, like I'm genuinely like struggling emotionally right now you know I know may maybe you guys don't care. Maybe some of you guys are just like, haha, you know, but it's like, dude, like, please, please don't tell me what to do. Please. There we go. Like, I beg you. <laughs> like, have mercy. Like, that's all I can really ask is just have mercy on me. You know? Have some mercy. Dear chat room. I don't want to see any fucking DMs after this run, like, hey, hope you're doing all right. I don't want to see any of that. <laughs> oh my god. I'm finishing this run. Like, I didn't quit. Please note that I did not quit. Like, I'm maybe, again, maybe a lot of you guys don't give a fuck one way or the other, but I just want to point that out. I did not quit. Yeah, someday I'll be good, true. Like you.
Took me seven minutes or eight minutes or whatever of attempts. Crazy. <sighs> Thank you, wireless. I'll read that in a moment. What's better, five gifts or tier three? Uh, I don't know, do, do five gifts. It doesn't matter. Just for the sake of other people enjoying stuff. And thanks if you do actually do that. Power House, thank you for the uh, bits. What is it? So when I have the rat here, I have to just go into this corner, I think. I have a fucking headache. I put way too much of myself into that last room. I I really put it all on the line. I don't think like... I'm not sure if maybe you guys like understand or not. So I think some of you do, maybe some of you don't. Um, I really put everything, my whole self into that last run. I was like, so I'm not trying to sound dramatic. I'm just keeping it like honest with you guys. I struggled to find the, the emotional capacity, the focus, the energy, the like the mental energy to continue at this point. Cause I really dumped it all into that last run. Every last ounce of focus, of, of, of rage, of recovery, of making it work regardless. Like, it, it is draining. It is draining. To put, to put it all, like, on the line like that. People who speedrun get it. Oh my gosh. People who speedrun get it. Maybe. But yeah, I feel very drained after that run. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I don't want to quit playing. I do want to do more runs. I've only been going for like three and a half hours and I'm playing well today. So I'll probably hop into a few more, but we'll, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Come on. Here we go. All right. Before I deliberate too much, I'll just hop into another. Thank you, Wireless, for the five gifts. And Bailey with the two pounds. Appreciate both you guys. Septimoon with the prime. Oh. Love you. Thank you for the kind words. Let's get it. Okay, rolling. Oh, it's been peaceful. I have a fucking headache, dude. All right. Let's, let's see if I can gather it, gather the will to like conjure up a run like that again. It's, I, I might, I, sh I should have probably like taken a break or something and like came back, but whatever. The most important step you could take is the next one. Okay, thank you, fucking poster from my elementary school classroom. Any other words of wisdom from the chat? Thank you for the good luck, Paplock. Has he said anything? Dude, you can just talk straight to me, Septimoon. You don't have to ask my chat. You can just... Like, I'm reading the chat, you know? Um... 
Yeah, I did the wheel of wheel of pain for all three crash games. I mean, what's what would the next one be? I don't I obviously like I'm not really in a headspace to talk like casual challenges and stuff. I have casual things planned for after this grind is done. Maybe next week. But uh, I don't I don't plan on doing the wheel of pain any again anytime soon. What's up, Chiyu? Thank you for the good luck. Dude, keep missing. Fucking blue. Thank you, Allie, for the good luck. No lotion. Cheers, space.
So cool. Down 10. Awesome. Down 10 gems there. Oh, damn, another five. Dude, it's just like, ouch. Like, you know? Like, when am I going to get a run that just gets the fucking gems, dude? Like, what the fuck? Like, <laughs> fuck this game. Good of an attempt there on that. Still green though. Okay. All right, we got some recoveries to do here. Lazi, thank you for the five gifts. Love you, Lazi. You're the best. If you just got a sub right now, spam a spinning Spyro. How much Discord servers do I mod? One? <laughs> My own? You're saying I look like a Discord mod, or is, is what you're saying? You're saying I, I look like the fat Latino guy from that one meme. Is that what I, is that what I look like? I look like a fat Latino man, do you? <laughs> Basket of lotion with five gifts. Fucking legend. Thank you for that, man. I fucking love you guys. You guys are making this grind worth it. In more ways than one.
sorry, bro. Why do you feel bad? I am I am a fat Latino man. I I look white, but I actually I'm half Chilean, so I technically count as a fat Latino man. So I mean, you were pretty much on the money. Discord mod looking ass. I'm not gonna pretend like my hairline isn't like. Look at this. Look at that shit. I mean, dog. I'm about to look like uh, about to look like Martin. I'm about to look like the monk default monk class in D and D. You know what I'm saying? Call me Martin Septum. Not a biggie missing the thief, I just have to make sure I collect every single thief from here to the end. I have to grab the extra in Wizard Peak, basically. Juicy time save, ladies and gents. Let's see if we can keep this together. Okay, I'm gonna go wide on the uh, tornado here. Could go on the inside edge, but we're playing it safe. Yep. Good thing I played it safe. I would have gotten hit and cried like a little baby. But I'm not liking this cycle. Uh yeah, I got I got the unlucky cycle, unfortunately. Kinda rare, but whatever, not a big deal. Thank you, Blue Shine. It's a new mic. The road, uh, what is it called? The road uh pro caster, because I'm a pro. Penis caster. Losing a little time for the for the bad cycle, but not a big deal.
Congrats on doing your taxes, Resident Evil. That guy sucks. Need to grab this guy. Need that blue. Yeah, losing a bit of time here. A couple gems. It's still green, I think. Just barely. Yeah. Chilling. What the fuck? Oh my god, that scared the shit out of me. Fucking disc, bro. Oh my god. Holy shit. Did that scare you guys? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh my god, that's so... <sighs> we're, we're good, we're good. That happens when you have a scratch disc. The music pointer gets kind of wonky. Oh my god. That was fucking unsaid. That fucking woke me up right there. <laughs> Your fucking music jump scare. It had to cut to a part of the song that was like really loud too. Was it a fucking metal head or some shit? Gemmed here. Let's see if we can get some blowhard IL strats here. Also annoying. Still technically faster than my yeah, this is still saving time, I think. Just not as fast as it could have been. Even faster strat done suboptimally is you know net even, I guess. Makes sense. All right. gem I can get at this point. Lucky I didn't bonk there. Let's see what the gem count is. That's good. Actually, my gem count's good. I'm surprised by that. Thought it was gonna be bad. 
We can get ballsy. And bog. Who's down for a ballsy bog? I always wear glasses, Paplock. I don't like contacts. I don't like touching my eyeball like that. Thank you, Scurry. Thank you, Mika. Okay, let's get it. It's not good, but it's still got sparks. Hit me. I'm really thorough there so I can be more ballsy downstairs. Calculated play. Annoying. Oh god, quickly. Right, we're fine, we're fine. I'm not gonna say this is the fastest shit ever. Let's see what happens here. This is a big part right here. Okay, down 10. We'll take that. I mean, you know, it's fine. It's fine. It wasn't ideal, but it was fine. some sketchiness here but maybe still saving time if we have a good we got to kind of pray for the damageless guanton here Let's see what happens beautiful that's exactly what we wanted Beautiful time save as well. Down, losing like 20, 30 gems there. Yeah, like just over, th yeah, like 24 gems or so. But we had the gem count to accommodate that. Now let's not lose anything more here. Let's, that was my gem burn right there. Now let's keep it solid.
Whatever. The game doesn't want me to have that, whatever. Not bad. That's not gonna work. Big time loss. I will go for these. Oh no! I think my run's dead. Just like that, everybody. It happens that quickly. It's pretty sad. I'm gonna try to make it work. Zoom through this shit, grab me this. But I might be under gemmed as a result of all that, we'll see. Definitely losing some time. Just hold on to the sparks for dear life. I have, a, I have a bad feeling that I've burned too many gems in this level. Instead of 449. Yeah, uh, we'll see what this is. We want at least 5105 here. Yeah. Yeah, we're under gemmed. This is a problem. I'm gonna have to grab a lot of extra stuff in Jock. It's a shame. Barely getting that. I needed that too. At least saving some time here on this home world. I'm gonna have to grab both uh, fodders and dreamweavers. This is gonna be real rough recoveries here. I am green right now, but it's unlikely it will stay that way. But I'm gonna, I'm just gonna send it. You know, we'll see what happens. Ugh. Pray for me. attempt but not quite lost pretty much all my green there especially considering the extra movement for the fodder and I just want to reiterate I am I am uh, severely under gemmed right now so yeah I mean it's just a shame like how that uh how the end of that beast makers went I really played it I, I played it smart in bog I think I think I I was on track to make it happen in bog but treetops and metalhead, especially metalhead, just did not go my way, unfortunately. And I was really close to like, but yeah. Once you start burning gems, and you know you got to really put a lid on it. I was not able to close the gem burning lid there, and I flew too close to the sun, and uh, my wings turned into cum, unfortunately. But I don't know, you know. I mean, if I play like really well. 
maybe there's a chance still. We'll see. But yeah, we're probably going to be like around even coming out of this level. Something like that. And then we have to just somehow not lose. Okay, we're like a little ahead. And we have to somehow not lose a bunch of time in Jock by and collect extra gems. So see what happens. But yeah, world record definitely dead. Man, that is bad. I'm gonna have to grab these. I should have grabbed them after, like we do in 120. I don't know why I did that that way. I'm I'm, I'm already choking it. Dude! It's over. Like, it's actually over. I have to do the whole rest of the level sparks loose? Yeah, fucking right, dude. I should have grabbed those greens back. Oh, no. It's over. It's over, everybody. I choked it. Thanks for watching. I'm sorry for failing you, dear Pace Pauls. Dude, just go. Just go. Thank you. I have to grab these greens. Sparks loose. Ha <laughs> ha. Uh, all right, there we go. There's my sparks back. Yeah, for sure way behind right now. That was crazy. That was wild. I mean, I'm not surprised at all. I'm surprised that I went sparksless because that was independent of the gem count problem, but having to recover all the gems on top of that, that was just like, that's so nail in the coffin type shit. I really got super close to getting like a fucking 35, like 4x on this run. I really did. It's like such a shame for me because like, like I just know, it's just one of those things like I know I can do it, but it's just, it just doesn't work out every time, you know? Give me this. All right, get me out of here. And now I'm just, uh, just like my last run that I completed, I am barely not able to PB. It's, and I've, it's like not even a 35. It's like, it's as if, it's as if that, like, I'm not on those paces. Because at least, even if you get fucked by the red, you'd be like, oh, at least I got a 35. No, can't, I can't even say that. I'm trash. Like, it's so it's so sad. I know I'm better than this, you know? Than, the, than what the results show. Cool, nice choke. I could, I could have made that rat work. I totally choked that setup. No, no. Over a correction. I'm just that this is these are my fault. These rats are in good positions. They're just I'm just choking them at this point. Oh, that was close. That was a very close one. Got a little too far to the right of them. Give it to me on this one, please. Didn't press right early enough. That was my fault again. All mo pretty much all of those were my fault. Really, really uh, tough. Really tough day, everybody. Uh, I have to, I have to do it to the right. Oh, nice, good adjustment. You guys hear? I said I have to do it to the right. That wouldn't have worked if I hadn't done it that way. That was cool. Cool recovery. Oh man, but you know, it's it's a really. I mean, I'm feeling very mixed right now. You know, like on the one hand, I definitely have been playing very well today. Like, I part of me wants to just keep grinding runs, you know, because I'm playing so well. But on the other hand, like my mental health is really struggling right now. Like, if I'm being completely honest, this is really like, this is really uh, taking a toll on me. Um, but I feel like I should do another run. You know, it's just a. Uh, I don't, I don't know. I, I don't really know what else to say. Like, I'm playing well, so I, I have to, I guess. You know? Go ahead and um, take a little break right now. Oh, I'm just gonna sit here for right now. Just take a second. Sorry, I took so long. I kind of forgot about you.
What about Ganasty Ganork? This is so hard, Ganasty dude. Nork? This is so hard. I had it. I, I had so the clean, like, order over gem bog, kingdom? like, burn. I, I had, it was right there. I had a great bog. What will you and I just next? threw it, dude. I'd say the sky's the Every time I, I missed the out of bounds of metal, I missed a five that I needed, by the way, in treetops. It was just such a, it was just so sad. It's just so sad. It's like when I need it, I can't get it, dude. It's, it's just so, it's really hard. And it's like, I can't even have a, today I've been playing like at, like at such a high level and I don't even have a 35 Dreamweavers. Like they've all just been choked in like the, late game it's really really disappointed I don't know I'm gonna go pee real quick um I'll be right back and I'm gonna try another just because I feel like I should um and I'll be right back thanks for the ggs everybody bad. <clears throat> With how tight gem get is it ever... Oh God, it's so hard to read. <laughs> With how tight gems get, is it ever worth the extra five seconds at the end of Town Square? to let gems fly in. At the end of Town Square, no. And then you asked another level, High Caves? No. I mean, sure, if you want to over gem, then yeah. Like, it, it can be worth it, depending on the context of your run. If you're under gemmed and you want to burn the second or two to grab the fucking, like, whatever, how many gems it is, then yeah. But theoretically speaking, we want gems to equate to three and a half gems per second spent moving, which is why we exit those levels in front of gems because it takes, it doesn't mathematically work out for that. I'm very, I'm very uh, exhausted. <laughs> if you can't tell, so I can't, sorry, I can't give you like the full, I don't know if that explains it. 
Yeah, I mean, but it could be worth it. I don't know, dude. What's up, Jupy? It's usually not worth it, but in certain scenarios, it could be worth it. There's your answer. I feel like I should just jump into another run, but it's like my rats are just so bad today. Like, I'm, I'm like starting to lose faith in myself. I'm not going to lie. Let's do it. Set the splits. Okay, rolling. Oh, drop my hydro flask. <laughs> Laura's been having a day. Let's not compare. Thanks. Yo, Laura, thank you for the raid. Appreciate it. Love you, Laura. Uh, hope your day's going good. I guess someone was saying your day's going bad, so I guess they spoke for you on that. This game sucks, yeah. So there you go. Yeah, dude, I'm getting so close to having some good runs today, but you know, so that I'm I'm playing well, so I feel kind of stuck. I feel like I have to continue. And so now I'm, it's like the fun factor is really going down, and like just the mental exhaustion is getting really really crazy for me right now. Like I'm kind of starting to lose my mind. But that's what that's what this is. That's what this grind is all about. Like I have to like be willing to, to take that to real to really work hard, you know, like that. Um Yeah, if, uh, I don't really have anything else to say. But thank you for the raid. Hope you're doing I mean, you know, you know what I mean. Thank you, Chiyu and Siona. By the way, Siona, thank you for the YouTube membership. Really appreciate that. Sucks. What? They just... What? He just ignored me? Okay. Maybe because the other one wasn't dead or something? I don't know. Something like that, probably. I'm gonna grab these extra gems here, even though they're not worth it. Just to recoup the gem count a little. Damn, three seconds. That loses. Oh! It's so painful. I'm starting to lose. I gotta stay locked in here, and I really struggling. Like my, I have a headache, you know, and it only gets worse. Like the more I play, I don't mean to complain too much. It's just, uh, I really feel. I hate the feeling of feeling like forced to play. I feel really like I'm forcing myself to play, and I don't like that. But I'm gonna stop complaining. <laughs> Don't like that. I got to strengthen up a little bit here. Right now, I'm 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 being very. I don't mean to like be like too like crazy about it, but I'm being very emotionally weak right now. Yeah, stop complaining. Like exactly. I mean, I know it's like it's just hard. I'm I'm just I'm just genuinely emotionally exhausted from today's grind. I'm not like mad. I'm not like super upset. I'm just I'm just very emotionally like spent. I've really put my all into runs today, and I've gotten some really good paces, and so that just that just takes a lot out of you, just over and over doing it, you know. Oof.
What can you do to make me feel better? Uh, do a YouTube membership or super chat or Twitch subscription. Throw money at me. That is literally more power. That is a more powerful way of making me feel better than anything you could say in my chat room. Am I greedy? Am I a fucking like bitch ass Twitch streamer for that? Yes, but I'm also honest about about it. You know, I'm not gonna like sit here and pretend like that. That isn't. That wouldn't make me happy to to get money thrown at me. You know, it's just the truth. I I can't lie to you guys. Three, two, one, go. But you don't have to. All right. Okay, rolling. Oh, it's been peaceful. British with the gift, thank oh. you. Love you, British. Yeah, you and Siona are definitely making me feel better these these last few these painful last few minutes here. Legends. Wireless with five gifts, thank you for that. And Panda with the heart bits, thank you. Love you guys. Balls. Balls. And two consciousness coming through with a cute little $1 super chat, man. Guys, thank you for all the support. It keeps me going in rough moments like this. It lifts my spirit when I am when it is dim. I'm glad, uh, Elaine. I mean, dude, honestly, like, the grind has been really good today. Like, even though, like, you know, like, some runs are done. Like, I'm getting, like, some, some of the best paces of my life today. They're just not making it to the rat, you know. But so, many of them are getting out of Magic Crafters on, on like, world recordable paces. I, it was the first time, my last run I did uh, was like the first run where I really was able to take shortcuts in bog and, and exit bog like minus 10, officially world record pace, according to my splits. So the, today's a big day, you know, like gameplay wise. I'm, I'm really, I'm, I'm happy for it. Even, even if things aren't, even if it's draining and exhausting, I am happy for it. I am happy I'm able to do this. Thank you, Jamlock. Oh, missing the blue there, that sucks. Yeah, losing time. No, I don't get chilly. And the reason why- Yo, Raz with five membership gifts, dude. Thank you for that, man. What a legend. Wow. That was really huge, Raz. Thank you for that, man. You're, you're really keeping it- man. That's very generous. No, I, I regulate my temperature by um, by turning on and off this fan. We also have AC and also uh, my room is being heated by many, by a giant CRT and computer screens. And I'm also sitting forward actively, you know, really trying to optimize gameplay where at times I there's adrenaline shooting through my body. You know, that, that warms me up as well. There's a lot of things warming me up and also cooling me down at the same time.
I really would not be able to go for four and a half hours like I am now without that. And even then, my head is still like hurting. And as you guys know, like I've been kind of whining about the uh, mental exhaustion of this, this grind. But we're not done yet. We're not done today until we're done today. What that means. Are all CRT screens made of glass? Uh, well, some CRTs are called projection CRTs, and those don't usually have screens made of glass, but like actual real CRTs, most of them have glass screens. Yeah. What's up, Cosby? Tucon, I'll try to remember that. You had a CRT back in the day. Your first TV in your room was like a square. Whenever you used to get angry, you'd slap the screen. I missed the glass monitors. Right. Um, I'm gonna eat. I'm like getting kind of hungry, so I'm gonna eat some uh some nuts real quick. I'll be right back in just a minute. I'm not done doing runs, so stick around. Here be.
All right. Okay, rolling. Oh, it's been peaceful. Mind and Organs Music, thank you for the two ninety nine. Appreciate that. Thank you for the welcome back. Yeah, I just had some quick healthy snacks. <clears throat> Almonds and blackberries and some carrots. With a creamy dill dip. Very cute stuff. Oh, and some pistachios as well. Sion Barzad, thank you for the prime. Hope you're doing good today, Sion. Why? Why am I doing that? I'm a fucking idiot. Game gems, I guess. Thank you, Sion. We'll see how well I can settle into this, like. L latter part of the grind here. Oh, how is that? I'm I'm losing the will to continue, guys. I'm gonna be honest. I'm I'm gonna try to chill and get into this, but if if uh, how about this? I'm at the four and a half hour mark. I'll give myself half an hour. If I can't get a run going in half an hour, then I'm done today. Three, two, one, go. Final push. Okay, rolling. Oh, it's been peaceful. That makes me really happy to hear Z. Thanks for sharing that. And thanks again to all the YouTube uh, super chatters and uh, members. You guys are tight. Yo, Derek, thank you for the good luck. Thanks for gassing me up in your stream earlier. That made me feel good. Hope the uh, Sprash effect went okay. Crashed. <laughs> well, there you go. GG. Oh, damn, but you were ahead. My goodness. GG, sir. Ugh. 
Dude, that's a reset. I refuse to miss two gems in the first fucking level. That's crazy. That's technically ten gems, actually. Two blues, not take on that. Today has been a really good day, um, in terms of my gameplay, my active focus, my ability to put down good paces is definitely better than average today. So I'm trying my best to ca uh, capitalize on that by just playing as much as I can. Uh, and that's coming at the cost of like a lot of, I've been getting on some heaters and they've been sort of dying and I've been no resetting them. And it's just been like a lot of adrenaline and focus and it's uh, mentally and emotionally exhausting is how I would describe like how today has been. Just because the potential is there, you know? So it's like you're trying extra hard and because you're trying extra hard for extra long, it's extra exhausting from like every angle. So yeah, very stressful day, exactly. Yeah, so, but you know, the since the opportunity is there, I'm like thankful today's better than average and I'm just trying to make the most of it and not just get offline the moment, you know, things get like hard and strenuous, you know? On days like this, I realize if I really want this any percent record, I have to keep pushing, you know? Because it's, it's not going to come easy. It's not going to be like a fuck. I sh it's not like I'm going to shit out world record or anything. Like, maybe, but not likely. I'm going to need to be, like, on a day like today and just push it until I can't push it anymore. And that's that comes at the cost of a lot of uh, happiness and mental health type type shit, you know. That's just, how the, that's just the name of the game, you know, for what for what we're trying to accomplish here. True, fam, true. Like, head ass. I should take some, like, ibuprofen or something. Nah, I just gotta, I just gotta push through. Got this, we don't need drugs. We don't need medicine where we're going. Oh, shit. Thirty-seven. I think that's a new best artisans for me. Very nice. I don't know if I've ever seen a three thirty-six before. Probably my older days of grinding back in twenty twenty-one, because we used to skip more gems back then. So I could see a three thirty-six happening back then, but that's at the cost of gems, of course. Yeah. 
Yeah, I would say overall that's probably my best artisans. Thank you, Colin. What? <laughs> How did that miss, dude? How am I that fucking stoned, bro? I fucking just completely miss her. I miss the world's fattest bitch. Cool. Oh, that was an epic maneuver. I mean, it's not like she it's not like she isn't a wide target, you know. Like, <laughs> three, two, one, go. Like hitting the broad side of a broad. <laughs> I missed the world's fattest bitch. It's true, dude. I really did. Okay, rolling. Oh. Just completely whiffed the mama. I gotta suppress these yawns a little bit. I don't want to start getting tired here. Sex is the greatest feeling in the world. I've never done anal before. Never given it or received it. Uh, I don't feel like I'm missing much, to be honest, with uh, with anal. You guys are having sex? Yeah, we have sex in the stream. Epic.
What's up, Frajado? Had a feeling. Oh my god, I can't stop yawning. Oh, fuck, and these stretches, dude, they're they're putting a lot of like uh, sleepy uh, chemicals through my body right now, these yawns and whatnot. It's not good. I'm trying to be on my crackhead shit in this game, you know? Trying to be like I'm trying to play like I'm on like I'm like a coked out Mike Tyson, ready to fucking get punched in the face by Logan Paul type beat. <laughs> yeah, I need some smelling salts. <laughs> yeah. Unironically, that might help with with such a feeling. I'm scared. I'm scared of smelling salts. Fuck. You guys see these yawns, dude? Who here is having his secondhand yawning right now? Thanks for the good luck, Fra. Froj. Grab a coffee? No. <laughs> no, I don't need no damn advice. Tell you to shut the fight. See, you already knew what I was what was coming. Why are you, why are you trying to suggest things to me, bro? You say that like I haven't already drinking an entire pot of coffee today. If I drink any more coffee, I'm gonna have such a headache. That just got like stuck on the seam there. Like I said, if I can't get past Mama Proxy today, by the five hour mark, we got like 13 minutes left to do this before I start to give up. Three, two, one, go. I'm just, I'm just like, like I said, it's like my body is starting to tell me like, dude, like it's time to stop. You know, usually I stop before this point. And now my body is really starting to catch up with me here. Okay, rolling. I'm, I'm like really struggling to stay awake, to be honest. Yeah, I need to pull over to the side of the highway here and just fall asleep midstream. Dude, I, I like I can't stop yawning, dude. Like I can't like my, I'm just preemptively opening my mouth like I'm ready for someone to just fucking Pour some suspicious liquid into it. I'm ready to get blasted by something. I just don't know what. I gotta close that mouth up. I gotta focus up, dude. <laughs> I'm opening my mouth like I'm ready for a Biden blast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if I have a headache, think how it Spyro feels, dude. True. There it is again, dude. I'm waiting for someone to come pour a beer in there, dude. Like, fucking goddamn. It's about that time of day. Yeah, this is my last push right now, dude. Last push. I, I, I really feel this grind coming to an end right now. So, I, this is my last push. Last, ru last run or a couple runs here. And then uh, that's it, because I'm just like... I'm starting to really... Really feel the uh, the deterioration.
<sighs> Fuck. God damn. These yawns just keep coming, man. They're like stormtroopers. See, I know a thing or two about Star Wars. You guys thought I didn't know anything about Star Wars. I've never seen Star Wars, but I'm like familiar with the characters. It's like close enough, right? Pokemon. Wait until you meet Raz Al Gwei on Shinobi. Dog, what the fuck are you talking about? Shinobi? Like on fucking Seger, Seger Genesis? Seger Genesis? Oh, what the fuck? This is Spyro, bro. This isn't share your favorite fucking old boomer ass retro game hour. Okay? This isn't tell me your favorite Star Wars fucking movie right now. Tell me how much you want to fuck Princess Leia and shit. This is let's fucking wake up and get a run time. Wake up and smell the fucking dick in your mouth. You know? Golpushito. <laughs> yeah, that's my favorite Shinobi character, Golpushito. Wake up. Blah, table. That's not gonna work. Guys, it's so over for me today. Like, it's so over, you know? Look at Sparks, dude. Dude's fucking tripping out. Look at this guy. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh my God. Take a four hour nap. Bro, that's what Saboom would do. Saboom would fucking like grind for like, I remember this, last time he fucking really went for world record. He'd fucking like grind for like four hours. Fucking make food. Go just go offline, make food, take a nap, and then grind another like fucking six hours. And then just keep repeating that process. It's honestly a strat to do the double grind in one day. Like grind, take like a food slash nap break, and then get back to it. Like that's true dedication right there.
I'll try, since I promised I would go for half an hour before quitting, I'm gonna do one more. This is gonna be my last attempt. If not, if this is like not looking good at all, then that's it. Three, two, one, go. Good on you, Septimoon. On you're on a, some Sigma grind set. Everybody's proud of you. Yeah, if you get your body used to power naps, that's that's fine. I'm I'm not used to napping, so whenever I do nap, it like kind of fucks up my whole circadian shit. I like my days to be like, all right, I wake up, I like I like the rigidity and discipline of my days to like slowly unravel as the day goes on. So at the start of the day, my my regimen is like, okay, you, once I get out of bed, it's like I make the same breakfast, drink the whole pot of coffee, stand outside for a moment, do my runs, do my stream, get all that going. And then it's like, oh, all right, now I'm going to relax and just fucking drink and make food and whatnot. But yeah, if I was trying to be like on some Sigma fucking optimizing my life type shit, like I wouldn't sleep as long. I would take like maybe a power nap and do like the double grind in one day type type deal. Why do one four hour stream per day when you could do two, you know, like, and if you like get your sleep schedule right, like you could do that, you know, it's not, it's not like that's like a unreasonable thing to do. It's just, uh, I don't know. I don't know if I'm that guy, man, to be honest with you guys. I feel like that's a good way to burn yourself out, to be honest with you. I feel like what I'm doing is plenty. You know, I'll just put I'll just put it that way. You could always be doing something more. I think that's like the moral of the story. You could always be on some extra sigma bullshit. You know, you could be fucking alpha penis butt sex like. But the way you are now is fine. Like even if you're lazy or at least you do something. You know, that's kind of how I look at like my spiral grind. Like at least I show up every day, and I fucking grind for a few hours. You know. Some some days more hours than less. Some days I'm better than others. It's just kind of how it, it's just kind of how it goes, you know. And I'm not trying to fucking like this. Even just this, like a five hour grind, is like really pushing it for me. Even on a day where I'm playing good like this, like this really pushes me like mentally and physically. Like, if I'm really trying to get my best runs, that is. Even doing something for more than like an hour and a half, doing the same task for more than an hour and a half, even if you like it or you're interested by it, it's hard to stay focused. It's hard to be like at peak productivity for more than like an hour or two at the most at a time. Yeah, even jacking off. And which I know you guys love. I know you guys love jerking off for fucking, like, my entire stream. Some of you guys have been fucking just slamming your fucking hands against your genitals for the last five hours. And to you brave soldiers out there, I, uh, I commend you.
<sighs> These yawns out of here. Remember, this run, this run is it, okay? So if I fucking bonk on the goddamn glide in this level or I miss Bomber Proxy, like, that's it. Okay? You guys better hope I don't choke it too hard. You can already see the fucking movement deteriorating a little here. That guy had a, what, a gold or something? We'll see. I think 180 something. 189. He must have had a five, I think. Who knows? Let's roll. I, I'm gonna try, since I got past that jump, I am gonna try, even if Mama Proxy fails, I will try to no reset this. Because I don't really want to end on a fucking reset. So. No reset mode, activate. Let's see if I can do it. Hype up. Let's see if it's gonna be an interesting no reset or a painful one. Here we go. Mm hmm? Interesting. Good. All right. We have a run. Let's see if we can hold on to it. Down a few gems. Thank you, legendary. Ugh, whatever. It's wor that bonk was actually worth it for the five. Dude, I missed the ten. Oh, I'm already on a bad. I'm, I'm already conjuring some bad voodoo here with these gem misses. I'm down like 20, or roughly. It was a five, really? Yeah, whatever. Fuck you. Dude. I'm telling you, this isn't pretty. These gem misses are not, do not bode well. PB isn't dead yet, but it's just, it's just this. This is like very the, the rain cloud is forming around this run currently. Oh, barely. I thought I was bonking there for sure. Last run of the day. Post your spinners. If you got them, post them. Post whatever emote you got in the damn chat. 
Is, I, I need your energy. This is my this is my last shot today. I could keep grinding, but it's it's already starting to go downhill, and I I don't want to. It'll be bad if I keep resetting after this. This has been a monstrous grind today. I gotta say, I'm I'm actually really proud of of how much I pushed it. So let's see if we can end strong. Now, whether it's a PB or not or whatever, let's see if we can end strong. Thank you, Chiyukes. It's a lot for me. Pressing X, you fucking bitch. Don't. Oh my god. Dude, just let's just jump over all the fucking gems. whoop de doo Not like I need those. Goodness gracious. Yeah, I feel like I can't, I don't want to sit back in my chair because it's like too comfortable. It's like, oh, yes. It's like, no, no, no. We got to stay like, err, you know, we got to stay agitated. Play on point, you know. Oh, that was really bad. That was 15. Oh, what?
25 gems like that. Goodbye. This run's dead like that. I mean, it's not dead, but it's just like, wow. I'm floored. It happens that quick. You think everything's going smooth? I didn't even like bonk or anything. I just didn't perfectly flame charge twice. And that cost me 25 gems. That is fucked up. That's fucked up. That's all I gotta say. I missed the worst gems you could miss in this level. All of them. So now we're working from, from behind here. I am gonna be green here, I think, but at what cost? 25, 320 instead of 350. That's actually 30 gems lost total that, that I could have grabbed at the same uh, speed. Wow. Just wow. And I got the bad cycle again. whoop de doo No, this game just hates me. That's about it. Like, that that really is lights on PB right there. Even though I'm still pacing. It's just, it's just fucked. It's just fucked, ladies and gentlemen. I'm gonna have to make the most gargantuan recoveries later in the run that's, that are all gonna cost me time. Like, it's, it's just fucked. It, I might as well reset, you know, type type shit. But I'm not resetting this. This is my last run of the day, everybody. So, pretty fucking crazy. Do you have alternate routes? The alternate route is to just go off route and grab a couple extra gems in specific spots. Like right here, I, I don't know if it was you or someone else was asking, like, why not collect the extra gems here? Well, now I really should, you know? Let's grab those, you know? Like, now I have to just go to do those little tiny ex overextensions now for more gems. It's not like I need to fully reroute. Like, if I were to fully reroute that level, I'd do bike caves, right? And lose, like, 30 seconds to get another 100 gems back. But that's not necessary. Even when you are severely over gem like, under gem like this. What's up, Ryze? I need that. I literally can't. I have to turn around for every missed gem at this point. I, I can't like skip past any gems now. This is very sad. Those are both blues. Mr. Green there, but not a big deal. Okay, I got the other blue there. It seems sus. Yeah, we got it. Okay, good. What's up, Just Jordan? Good morning to you. Guns there. Yeah, dude. Missing some unfortunate greens here. I'm just so tired as well. Like, my eyes, like, ugh. 
This really, I'm so glad I'm not doing another run after this. Like it's, it's just so, I can just feel the downhill spiral. I can feel it physically, you know? Like I'm just struggling to keep my eyes open. I know I'm sounding like maybe really dramatic, but it's just, I've just been exerting so much energy in the last five hours. It's just, uh, it's just a lot. I'm just legitimately, I've made myself tired with how much like energy I've used. Maybe I'm not sweating or anything, but I'm like, I've used every piece of like mental, you know, energy that I have. Billy Bob, thank you for the uh, resub. You know, gym bros are like, what energy, bro? You're not even sweating, you know? But like, dude, I mean, I'm just, I'm just drained. Like, I'm so drained from this game today. And just seeing how this run's going, it's like, there's just no way I can be, even despite the pace being nice. There's just no way I can recover this amount of gems lost. It's it's kind of like a sad, like... It's like a shadow of a run, you know? That's how it is in this category when you're under gems. It's like, you feel like you're playing a fucking fake-ass, like... You're on some fake-ass shit. Yeah, you want to be close to 3,000 there. I was 2920. <laughs> I'm like 50 gems under right now, at least. So bad. Still half decent. This should be time save, I think. A little bit. Yeah, a little time save there. Not bad. But, you know, hey, for being a no reset, like, and for being horribly under gen, like, you know what? It could be worse. It's not PBable, but it could be worse. So let's try to keep the attitude in check, keep it moving, you know? Grab those extra reds, like literally trying to grab anything I can here. I might actually grab the uh, fan chests right here, even though this is slow. I genuinely need those gems. I need every gem I can get. Okay, that brought it back a bit. I actually probably didn't need to. I'm actually over exaggerating how far under gemmed I am. Since I grabbed some of those backups, it's actually not that bad anymore. So now we might have a chance, with whatever time loss we took there, we might have a chance at like not losing time in future splits if we play solidly and don't keep bleeding gems. We don't have room to lose any more gems though. But it's actually not that bad. We're probably gonna go back to being like plus six, plus eight, some shit like that. But the question is, can we bring it back? The time saves in world record? I don't know. I compare to my PB instead of world record. 
The time, and I don't even know where the time saves are there, really. There's some time save here in Bog, depending on the gem count, allowing you to skip gems or whatever. Since my gem count is not is not lenient right now, um, I can still save time here if I play well, but I have to be thorough with my gem collection. And yeah, compared to world record, I don't even know. I, last time I watched world record was like a hot minute ago. Um, I should maybe check out Ash's recent tie world record. Or I should maybe check out one of Laura's recent pacers out of Dreamweavers. I should do a lot of things and compare to a lot of things and I should be a different version of myself and I fucking am insecure and sad. But with that said, I am going to try to no reset this and make the most of it. So hopefully that answers your question. Oops, come on. Oh my god. Yep, he got me. That's fair. At least I had a sparks to burn there. This is slow, by the way. In case that's not obvious. I could have done that was the worst recovery I could have done missing the gem and getting eaten wow good recovery dumbass not saving time here really not getting the other green there Fuck, this run's so fucked. There's no way I'm bringing anything back right now. I have failed in this level already. But it's cool, we'll just do Guanton Sparksless. And hopefully everything goes fine. What could go wrong? Not gonna, they're gonna hit me. Yeah, dude, I can't get around that if he's in that position. So there you go. Didn't get lucky. I needed to get lucky there. I did not get lucky. Yep, again, he's in that spot. He's not always in that spot, but when he's in that spot, you're fucked. You do not need sparks to flame charge. As you can see, I was making gems home in without sparks downstairs when I was sparksless. Holy Lord in heaven, I hate my life. I totally threw the run. That's like so disappointing, but whatever. It's my life. At this, at this point, my only like goal now is to just like get to the end of the run and try not to be a massive baby because I basically failed today. Today, I basically had a chance to at least PB or at least get a run that at least had a chance of PB and going into the rat. I failed all of that. I did have some good paces at various points, you know, in like the mid game. Oh my God. I'm so, I'm so done, dude. I'm so cooked. I'm just so cooked, everybody. <laughs> so at this point, my only goal is to just not lose my mind. That's, that's really all the goal is anymore. This run's not good. If you want to see a good run, this is not what this is anymore. You can leave if that's what you're interested in. Sorry, pace pals. I tried. To, I really tried my best for you guys. I want you to know that if you're a pace pal, I really did everything I could for you today. But I really cannot do anymore. I'm not doing another reset. I played way longer than I genuinely feel comfortable with. I'm sparksless again. Where is he? I need this blue. This is just... This is just crazy. Like, I, I gotta just keep it together now. Ugh. Oh. 
We have to kill Rotis downstairs here. Dude. Come on. Wow. Dude. Ah! Sorry, I had to get that out of my system. I'm like actually so filled with, with so many feelings. Right? Like, just play the game. Just play the game. <laughs> you know? Just press X on the dragons. You know, you can't do that. Can't do that. Can't do that. Comical. This runs just turned comical. I really, I have to like fight this feeling like I failed today. Like, yeah, I failed to get a world record or whatever today, but like, I re Oh my god. I love being sparksless. I just love it. But yeah, I mean, just like, I just, I, it's like, yeah. I feel like I failed so hard today. Like, I, I really was given a chance by the universe to get it today. And I tried so hard and I didn't even get it. Like, I just, I just suck. Like, that's it. Like, hopefully I get lucky another day. And I can play well and capitalize on it. Shit's not easy, man. Okay, I gotta quit whining. That's like a important detail here. Just gonna do 120 strats. Oh. Cog, thank you for the prime. That brings me back to reality. Genuinely, it does. I'm like actually going insane, but that that actually helped bring me. Bring me back to Earth. It's like, ah, yes, like, there are humans watching this that are supportive, so thank you for that. Oh my god. Pushing through bad days, build resilience. Yeah, dude. We got some fucking philosophers in the chat here. We got some, we got fucking Neil deGrasse Tyson. Like that. Marathon man, thank you for the good luck. Appreciate it. This is my last run of the day. And it's kind of a failure, and I hate myself. But it's all good. No bitching. I'm, I'm, t I'm trying not to bitch right now. I'm failing. Oh my god, I needed that. But you know what I did need is to go sparksless. Oh, I'm dead. Actually. I'm gonna take a moment and just breathe right now. I'm, I'm not resetting. Yeah. We're continuing. I cannot handle this, everybody. Can't even get up this, okay. I'm gonna grab these gems because I don't even know what the fuck the gem count is. I'm just lost. Everybody, this is like a lost cause right now. I am going to finish this run. Oh my god. It's okay, dude. It's okay, you're a minute behind, dude. Your run sucks. It's okay, dude. It's okay, you were only trying to get world record for five hours straight. And it's okay. It's your last run. Make the most of it. Have fun. 
You might not get another day like this for a while. Good luck. Hope you get some good sleep for tomorrow. Maybe, maybe if you're lucky, you get to do this again tomorrow. You get to, if you're playing good, you get to go crazy again tomorrow. Because you feel like you have to. If you're lucky. Maybe you'll get, maybe you'll be, get unlucky. You know, and get a bad night of sleep and then you won't even get, be able to come close. That'd be cool too. Then you can have more fun by just no resetting and pretending like it doesn't fucking hurt, you know? Like, yeah. That sounds good. This all sounds great. This all does not sound bad at all. It's that one run I had today that really, like, I think really stood out. It was like being 10 seconds ahead, being ahead of world record, basically, coming out of bog. And then just shitting it. Just fucking it. And that was it. That was the high point of five hours of grinding. That was the closest I felt to being alive today. P, hey, thank you for the gift, oh. man. I really appreciate that. You're, you're keeping me going. For better or for worse, you're keeping me going. I did not see what the gem count was. I need to check. Is he playing with my fucking splits? 631, that's fine. I think I can skip the gold here, actually. I, I might be wrong about that. We'll see. Forgot about the whole not having sparks for the whole fucking run thing. Oh yeah, forgot about this guy. I'm just like forgetting about everything. It's good that I'm not doing any more runs though, because I, I can feel like those, those lapses and like the fact that I didn't think to flame the mushroom guy first, like that shows where my focus level is at. It's just so deteriorated now. I'm just too tired. What's up, Mike? How you doing? Irish Eagle, thank you for the five dollars. Um, no, this is. Uh, you kinda, I think you misheard me. I feel dead right now. To be very clear, I feel like a soul. I mean, I look. I'm not trying to complain. Thank you for the five dollars. Yes, the your five dollars makes me feel alive. I'll say that much. Thank you. Maybe getting rat proxy will help as well. Look, who cares if I feel alive or dead? I'm being very dramatic right now. Let's just get rat proxy. good attempt as well, but not quite. Ooh, man, these... 
I blame the rat for that one. The black, the, he was too far to the right. I should have maybe done the, the pillar there. No, I let him run. I'm a fucking... I tried setting up too hard. It's kind of a funny irony that today, like, I was... I really felt that I was playing super well, and yet this is one of my worst rat days of all time, actually. It really doesn't matter if I'm playing well on a given day. I might as well have not grinded for as hard as I did, you know, for how badly my rats are going to. Like, just what difference does it make, you know? If the goal is a good end time. Just some days the trick just clicks more than others. That's all I can really say. And unfortunately, like the, I think the nature of of the trick with Rat Proxy is that, um, you know, it doesn't always coincide with like you're playing well, so you're naturally gonna click better with a trick like this. Like it's so detached from like the normal gameplay. I feel like, like the way you have to look at it. Like having a good mind for setting up this trick is different than having like a really focused like, you know, mind for like actual execution. It's just all going so bad. Everything's going so bad. Close. That was the closest I've got, sadly. It won't work trying to do it like that from that angle. I have to do it against the pillar when he's when he's that far to the right. To be honest, something may have to change about Rat Skip. It's too inconsistent. Thank you for sharing. Oh, I should have gone against the. Uh, um, should have gone against the pillar. Yeah, like. Look, guys, if you think this trick is like too inconsistent to like grind in runs, well, that's why you don't have a good run of this game, okay? But I personally feel like I could get a good run and get this trick. Even if you don't think that, even if you're watching this, you're like, how is that ever going to happen? Well, I happen to have more faith in myself than you do in that sense, you know? And it's okay, like, but you don't have to go and tell me, I, I, it's never going to happen, you know? You don't got to be all fucking pessimistic, little bitch in my chat about it. Like, Jesus Christ. Oh my god, <laughs> that was tight. Yeah, I mean, it'd be great if, you know what I mean? It'd be great if something like, if this trick even got more consistent. From my perspective, and you guys, like, here's the thing, is like, I can tell, like, when you, like, that you guys don't play this game, you know? By, like, the way you word stuff, it's like, it's too inconsistent, it's so random. Dude, we've taken out a lot of the random factors of this. A lot of what I'm experiencing issue-wise is like, I have some bad execution on these. Sometimes it's bad luck, sometimes it's bad execution. But rarely is it like, oh, I just randomly got fucked. It's like, there's there's a rhyme and reason to this. It's not like completely arbitrary. There is some luck, you know, I'm not gonna lie. But compared to how this trick used to be, and I used to do runs back then. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, you guys have the fucking luxury of sitting behind a fucking keyboard watching me fail over and over because I'm having a particularly bad day with this trick and being like, hmm, it's so inconsistent, hmm, I just don't know if it's legit. Man, fuck you. Like, let me, like, just fucking, like, do my thing, you know what I mean? I don't, I don't want your opinion like that, you know? I just don't want that. It's not helping me.
If you want to bring me down to your pessimistic level with it, then, I mean, like, what's, what's the goal of this conversation, you know? You want me to be like, yeah, you're right, it isn't too inconsistent. I'm gonna go do something else. Like, you know? Like, we don't do this, this hot, we don't do this shit because it's easy. You know, like, well, <laughs> you know what I mean? So spare me. Ugh. And also, I want to reiterate, I'm fucking up a lot here. It's not like just the rat's fault. But you, I mean, you, like, you guys don't realize that. Like, you guys don't have the experience with this trick. Nice, that was sick. You guys don't have the experience with this shit to, like, know when it's my fault and when it's the game's fault. That's okay. So that's why you gotta leave your fucking shitty opinion at the door, please. Fuck's sake, I'm five hours into this grind, and I gotta read shit like, hmm, TBH, I think it's too inconsistent. Bitch, shut the fuck up. Oh my god. Thank you for watching. Anyways, I hope that answers your question. <laughs> Yeah, first try. Yeah, dude, that fucking- that rat proxy I got was fucking hilarious. Yeah, I mean, if you guys disagree with me, like, on this subject, like, that's fine. It's cool. Like, you guys are right. Like, rat proxy is really hard, you know? Like, it's pretty in it's still inconsistent, despite being more consistent after all these years. I'm not gonna argue that. My last biggest man, appreciate you man less than three. But like after five hours of grinding and you're gonna get all fucking like you're gonna get all critical about the fucking run, like it's like man, fuck off, dude. Like just let me like You know? Sorry I took so long. I don't, I'm not I'm not trying to have a discussion like I don't know how I don't know if it, the rat's consistent enough. I've already decided that it's consistent enough for me to do it. I've already decided that. So I'm not trying to have that discussion anymore. I hope that makes sense. What will you I know I probably sound like a massive dick right now. Telling you guys to fuck off and stuff, but yeah, dude, like, five, almost six hour grind today. Five and a half hours. British Cloudy, thank you for the hundred bits. Thank you everyone for subbing and supporting and watching today. It was a really hard day. Like, um, I was playing really well and I did not close out any run that I was particularly proud of. Uh, so it was just a tough one for me. It was, tr it was truly a difficult one for me. And, um... Yeah, I mean, it's it's not pretty. Like, what, what I'm doing here, it's not, like, a pretty process. It's not a fun process. It's really, it's really sad, honestly, that, like, I'm getting this heated over a fucking kid's game. You know? Like, th there's nothing beautiful, there's nothing pretty about this. It's pretty, pretty lame, honestly. I'm pretty lame. But, um, but I'm still going, you know? I'm not quitting. I'm continuing. I'm holding str I'm holding fast. I'm not biting on the whole like, oh, is rat proxy consistent? I'm not even gonna bite. You know what I'm saying? That's like my point here. It's like, I'm gonna keep doing this until I don't know what happens. And you know what? That's not that's not the good move for my for my mental health. For for my happiness even. But it's what I wanna do. And that's that. So I hope you guys um enjoy the grind despite the the highs and lows of it despite what's admirable and what's pathetic about it and um you know thanks for watching look he didn't mean anything by it he was just being a fucking armchair speedrunner that's all, like you said he wasn't trying to be mean about it he, here, here's the thing, is you guys always want to have a discussion about some bullshit that I don't give a fuck, like, you know what I mean? That's just the truth. You guys always want to, having never speed ran ever in your life, you want to have a fucking discussion with me about, like, the validity of strategies and stuff. Like, dog, you don't play the game. You don't even know what you're talking, like, no offense, but you don't know what you're talking about, you know? You can sit here and watch a million runs, you know? And be like, hmm, this looks legit. This looks consistent. This, what do you think about the consistency of this? Oh my god. Just keep it to yourself, dude. Just keep it to yourself. I appreciate you being interested. This goes for anybody. I appreciate you guys being interested by this run. 
Keep the fucking like armchair speed. Realize when you are an armchair speedrunner. Just realize it. You know? I don't I personally don't care for armchair speedrunners in my chat. They they drive me a little crazy. Because it's very clear that like, you know, I could fucking sit here and discuss until the cows come home, you know, but like it accomplishes nothing, you know? It's just like such a roundabout, pointless like discussion, you know? To get all theoretical about, oh well, what if we say what if we uh, did this gem and did that gem, you know? Like if you really if you really want to lab that stuff and figure it out and you know, you gotta you gotta do that and like share with the spire. Don't don't come in my chat while I'm fucking losing my mind on runs. You know? Go share that with the actual speedrunning community. You won't. And that's the problem. <laughs> Like, some of you guys actually genuinely have decent ideas sometimes. But it's you're, if you're just sharing in my chat, it's just like, it's like farting in the wind, dude. Like, if you really think you have a good idea about something in this game, even if you don't speedrun it, that's fine. Go share that with the Spyro Discord. Don't fucking tell me, you know? Like, I'm gonna be like, oh, yeah, you know, even though my run's going terribly and I hate my life, you know what, you're right. <laughs> like, I, you know? Maybe, maybe I should be nicer. I will say that. Maybe I should be nicer, but it's just, it's just how I feel, you know? It's just how I feel. It's like I don't really want to have a discussion like that, you know, all the time. Sometimes I do, but usually, like, I, I don't, you know? Especially with people who, like, don't fucking, like, play the game, you know? Have I been drinking? No. Anyways, guys, I don't mean to be like a fucking... I know I'm being like such a fucking wet towel right now. I, I want to reiterate, I appreciate everyone for being here. Even if you are a fucking annoying bitch in my chat, I appreciate it. And, um, yeah, I'm, I'm sorry for being like so, like, whatever. I'm just, I'm just completely, like, you gotta, you gotta understand. I'm, it's, it's really nothing personal against any of you guys. It's just, I have gone, like, to the edge of my sanity and back today. And it, it was a tough day. And, um, yeah. So, thanks for understanding. Thanks for not get, taking anything I'm saying too personally. If you are like a, if you feel like any of the things I'm saying like that annoy me apply to you, please don't take it personally. No, it wasn't you, Mika. You're good. I mean, who cares what you guys say? No, but you know, it's it's on me not to let anything you guys say bother me. That's that's the truth about it. I'm gonna find someone to raid. Um, let's see what's going on here. I mean, yeah, I mean, I am definitely just an emotional creature right now, for sure. I'm just like, it's a, I'm struggling I'm very. Like, whoa, a, I'm, shut the fuck up. I'm just uh, struggling. That was, <laughs> that was me, my own stream there. I guess I'll raid Ash. Ash grinding, we gotta raid Ash. Or Spora, I guess. Dude, how, how is, dude, how, and then so like, I'm losing my mind on these runs like this. And then Ash is like, right now, they're fucking 11 seconds ahead of world record in treetops. Like it's nothing, dude. Like it's nothing. Ash is on such another level. This is why I'm losing my mind, everybody. <laughs> like, like, dude. That's what I'm saying. Like, if I beat world record, it'll just be for like a couple days and then Ash or Laura or someone will beat it. It's just like, it feels like a really like fruitless effort, you know? Watch, Ash is gonna beat world record right now. Ash is gonna get like a 37-0 something and then, ugh. I mean, and, and props to them, you know, props to them for that, not to put anything against them. It's just like, oh my God, just comparing to myself, it just drives, I'm just losing my mind. Uh, let's, uh, let me start the raid here.
Thank you, everybody, for watching one more time. I love you guys all very much. And uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.